Oh no. The actual Mark Andrews? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. He, uh, yeah, he's a striker on a rival soccer team. He's your R.A.? Yeah. And also, uh, his dad used to make him chug a Red Bull before every soccer game. Do you think he's still does that? I hope not. <laughs> you fucked up? Yo, what up, boys? Hello. Hello, how's it going? I was gonna start playing Minecraft. Well, why? Look, it's Minecraft. I don't think you're prevented from playing it because of my presence online. Hello, thank you, Sided Williams, for the seven months. Yo, 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 yo. What up? What up? What up? What is up, boys? I heard you're filming a music video on Wednesday. Do you guys have sync licenses to your songs as well? The fuck is that? <laughs> you need a sync license to match my lips to it? Is that a thing? Hold up, let me tell you. So, if I check... Baby, it's cold outside. Didn't even get copyright claimed by YouTube. So, I don't think they know I took their song. I think we're fine. Isn't it old enough? What's the rule? 70 years? It's an old song. Did your comedy background help you stream? No, just uh, all natural talent. Hey, Pierce, thank you the one year, buddy. Annie boy, the prime smoking woke in the three months. Welcome to the uh, the stream, boys. Welcome back. How's it going? We have uh, another Pokemon box today, our final one. This is our final Pokemon box ever. Did the notification go live? Yes, it did. Perfect. Your view says zero. I'm washed. This is it. This is our plan today. We're going to open this up. with, And we have special guest Ben. Who, there he is. Who came to visit and his car is broken down and hasn't been fixed. And so he's going to hang out and open a box with us. He's the guy who does You're My Mans and What. No, you're what? No, you're what? I'm what? Yeah, remember in the you did the the roast of Hugo. Oh yeah, that was. In the me. crowd, you went what? I forgot that was me. Yeah, that's you. You are a very popular voice, unbeknownst to most. Dude, I'm gonna go drop my uh, Ludwig founder talk in your chat real quick. Oh, you're gonna chat? You do you have a a resub? No, I'm a, but I'm a founder. You are a founder. Yeah, that's big. It is big. There's only 25. By the by, boys, do me a favor. Double check to see if you guys have a Twitch Prime available. All you gotta do is click on a stream you really like. I like watching chess, so I'm gonna check out chess, and you click subscribe, and it says subscribe free. Look, every day, boys, at least 200 of your Primes will be new, and it happens at exactly 3.55 p.m. So this is so funny. This is so convenient. There it is. Founder Ben. Look at that, Tree Weenie. Yours just renewed. All but one. What a funny coincidence that it's 3.55 and I called it out. Your hoodie comes tomorrow. Nice. We're a bit of an Easter duo. With the hoodies. Look at that. Just cute. Just two guys wearing hoodies. I already used my Prime. That's fine. I appreciate it. Wasn't crowd control Pokemon today? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the plan was originally to play crowd control Pokemon today. But Ben's car hasn't been fixed, so he's staying another day. And uh, we're actually playing fantasy football against each other um, in like an hour. We're in the, the playoffs of fantasy football, and he has one player left, Mark Andrews, and I'm up by 16 points. So I wanted to do a short little stream and then sweat that game with my friend Ben rather than, you know, go live for six, ten hours. You know, that's the cool thing about being a streamer. I can just say, fuck it, I'm not going to do it today. But instead, I thought I'd go live and we'd open this up because I want to do that too. So that's the plan. All makes sense. All smiley faces, if you understand. Andrews is so inconsistent. Well, I mean, he also dropped a 23 bomb, apparently. He had COVID, man. He did have co Ben saying he had COVID. It's hard to come back from you gotta COVID. You got to kiss the mic. You got to get real. I got to kiss her? Yeah, you can bring her in, too. He had COVID. He had COVID. So you're making fun of a man with COVID now. Yeah. That's what you're doing. Anybody else? Fuck Mark Andrews. I'm not on your side. <laughs> He's inconsistent <laughs> trash. Yeah, apparently Ben was talking about how he played soccer with Mark Andrews. 
Yeah, so, he was an elite soccer player as well. Do you send him a kiss, text? Good luck, baby. I didn't, I didn't know him like that. Yeah. Uh, hate bit. Thank you. The five gifted. Blank the three months. Vesmia. Thank you. The 22. Wow. OG in this bitch. How many months are you subbed? I'm... Damn. Are we three years yet? No, I'm like two and a half years. No, it's got to be more because three years is January. Mm, I think. I, I did have... When I was getting my card replaced, I may have missed like a month or two, so... Wow. I think you know, man. It, it wasn't a consistent... No, That's whatever, man. It is Ben from Mario Party League. This claim to fame. E-girl casting the five gifted HVBBS underscore underscore hubs. What's up, man? Thank you for the subs, boys. So anyway, that's the plan. That's all we're doing today is we are opening up this Pokemon fossil box. We're going to see what's inside. The goal behind this stream, boys, the goal behind this stream is to find out how much money I would lose if I open all the cards up, I sell them all after getting them all graded. Like, wh where do I end up? We're doing this like Mr. Beast does his scratch cards. You know what I mean? <laughs> no one gets a pack. I get all 36 packs because I need to sell them all. And if I sell them to you at a markup just because, uh, you know, I get to open it on stream and you get a shout out, then it doesn't really... This is like a layman. Like, if you... Let's just imagine for a moment your your grandfather passes away from old age after living a very happy life, never had an illness outside of that. And he has a fortune, he passes down, and you spend all of the money on Pokemon cards. Is that a good idea or a bad idea? I think we all inherently know that it's genius, and there's nothing wrong with buying Pokemon cards. It's basically like w w earning money. But we're going to find out for sure, for sure. And that's uh, that's our idea today. It's not, I, it's not the it's most it's What's not the most sound investment, but yeah, it's a gamble. But yeah. how much of a gamble is it? Did you ever watch Mr. Beast's videos? Yeah, he's uh, I watch his hide and seek videos. That's Have you ever seen, seen his scratch ticket one? Is it just seeing how much he comes out? Yeah, so it's it's ba he basically I think the most I think he did a million dollars in scratchers and eh? scratchers. So he just bought scratchers, and he had just a team of people cycle through. What the hell is that? Yeah, a million dollars on Scratchers. And it came through? And he ended up with... 720000 So a net loss of about... He lost 280000 yeah. 72% return. Honestly, better than I thought. I think it'll be... I think that's... I think Pokemon cards will be better... I don't. It's different with Pokemon cards though, because you also have to pay to get them graded, yep. pay to ship them out to people, take the eBay fee. Uh, so it's and it's also a fluctuating market. Yeah, it's not straight cold highly hard fluctuating cash. market. Also, you might just pull shit. Yeah, there's a lot of variables. Thank you for the uh, five gifted Grogare, one cell Joe, the three hundred bits T boy, the five months jolly good boy, the rots your one Zach Kutiek, Kutik Kutik, the rots your one. <laughs> They got funny names. Yeah. Dude, last night, though, it would have been uh, quite a net loss for Mizkiff if he didn't snag the... Uh, if Mizzy didn't get... I mean, his Lugia still blows cock. I feel bad for him. You think it's him. weak? It's he was, he weak. was talking it up. Yeah, of course Miz was talking it up. So this is why I'm doing this is because we were doing Pokemon Week, and any card would come up on stream, and Miz would just call it a 10. <laughs> He'd be like, that's a 10. That's worth like 5K. <laughs> and so 10. someone finished their box, and he's like, that box is worth 70,000. And the guy paid like 30K for it. And it's like, no shot. All of those are PSA 10s. It's worth 70000 You know? And then a lot of people have been hating on Pokemon Week because they basically think we're, like, inflating the value of the cards by giving it the grading yeah. without actually getting the grading. So that's uh, that's this. That's this experiment. Dude, you have a higher chance of all your holographics being Lugia than you do all your cards being PSA 10s, I feel like. Yeah. Yeah, probably. <laughs> that's probably accurate. But I, I don't. I genuinely don't know. Like, what would the lowest grading be? Is there a chance to get like a seven? Like, how bad can it get? I thought you told me that the lowest out the box could be an eight. That's what I think, but I don't know. No, I've never done it. That's just like when when I hear the experts talk. That's what they say. His Lugia is solid. It was all right. I mean, it had um, a okay like cornering and no whitening but it had a corner it had a centering problems and then it had a giant hollow miss like what do you call that a hollow print a hollow mark are you talking about the the imprint on the a 
Yeah. No, he, uh, I watched it a bit longer after you stopped, and the 10 that sold online had that exact same marking on the A. I thought they said that it, uh, I thought for, I thought that was a different A that had that mark. Okay. Because I remember hearing Island say that, and then he said it was a different A. Because uh, I have that Lugia, and it doesn't yeah. have the A. Well, you have a stinky 8. Why are you going to call my Lugia? Still, I spent money on that. It was a good Lugia. Still a stinky 8. Did I show you my collection? No, I, don't think I've shown I, you I haven't seen cards. the whole thing. Oh. You kinda, they're kind of laid out scattered around here. True. I have a box I'll show you in a second. But I, I have a story chat. Chat. So today, I uh, we went to Target to get uh, things, affairs for Cutie's baking stream. And I picked up a, uh, a sword and shield tin that had uh, score money on it. It was a sword and shield tin. Um, like a child, I, my phone doesn't have cellular data, and we're going to go through the <laughs> Starbucks drive through And I wanted something to do in the car. So I got this tin uh, to open the five packs in the car. And I had two Sword and Shield packs, uh, Unbroken Bonds, a Cosmic Eclipse, and uh, XY Evolutions, which is like, you know, really great box set. Uh, and then I noticed while in the drive-thru, coincidentally, without communicating at all, my roommates, Nick and Aiden, were two spots behind me. Literally in the same Starbucks drive-thru. And I'd opened all of my packs except for the Evolutions to like, you know, save it for the hype. And then I saw them in the rearview mirror, and I was like, oh, shit. So I get out of my car. I open up my pack in front of them, and I do an unboxing. And I, and I, and I, and I have a, a, a holographic Chansey, which is like a pretty sick card. I got, I got an actual holo. Wait for it. There. I thought you were supposed to, like, tap it or something. And usually it just autofocuses, but it might. There oh, there it, it is. So I, I got a holographic Chansey and a reverse holo <laughs> Charizard. Totally unplanned. I pop off and run back to my car. I Google it later. This exact card has sold for five, six, seven, eight, even nine hundred dollars. PSA ten. And that was off in the past month. That was off a twenty-five dollar Target tin. Yeah, it was a twenty-five dollar <laughs> Target tin, and I got both of these cards. It was actually nuts. It was a it was a special moment. I I gave basically Aiden and uh, Nick my stream content um, instead of you know. Doing it for you guys. Anyway, boys, before we jump into this box, uh, quick shout outs to NordVPN. Uh, NordVPN, proud sponsor of this stream. Exclamation point NordVPN in chat. Or drop the emo or click the panel link down below. You can use NordVPN to uh, protect your computer against things that are bad for your computer or get around content locked, region locked content, you know, to watch like anime from Japan. But, you know, they don't have it in America because shit works like that. So anyway, check out NordVPN if you do use code Ludwig. We'll shout out Audible later. Uh, all right, are we good to open this box? I think it's time to make it happen. We have a, a bit of a, a task to do. You wanna you wanna get? Oh, it? you're trying to get me to disassemble this? This is oh, you get the screwer. Oh, this it's is like that. This is yeah. This is not. This is absolutely no fooling around. This is nuclear code type shit. I think the nuke button probably has less security. I assume it's just a, a you know, quick this, thumbprint. This is not how all packs were shipped, right? In this... No, oh, yeah. I mean, this is like... This, this, this is just because it's old, right? Yeah, this would have been on the target shelf like it was today. I'll buy a heavy pack. I'm not selling any packs. Yeah, me and Ludwig are playing you pull it, you keep it. Exactly. Yeah. What? Wait, what? Yeah. Well, yeah. Pull it, I keep it, for sure. Yeah. Are these all your packs? All of them are mine. All 36. The box costs 20000 I put well, it in the title. Except we're playing. You pull it, you keep it. Well, okay. <laughs> no, for sure, for sure. Are you opening packs? Oh, I guess. Oh. I mean, that's why I'm here. Uh-huh. Yeah, you I know, we'll I get you. Just watch. No, we'll get... No, come on. We'll get you a couple packs. Light packs. Here's your mans. Oh, it's already out? Oh, look at that. quick. Made quick work. It's double wrapped. Oh, dead? Oh, let me get that. No, no, it's just a... Uh, oh. It's not the military-grade plastic. <laughs> That's nice. Uh, we'll get it, boys. I saw a homie asking about the ASU football game. Uh, the, the we fucking crushed, didn't The we? Sun Devils laid the smack down on, on, U of A. on the Wildcats, yeah. Yeah, this guy DM'd me the other day. He's like, I'm going to U of A like you. And I didn't have the heart to tell him. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, damn, bro. Not only are you not going to the same school, we're not friends because of the school you're going to. Yeah. And Tucson 
Sorry if you live in Tucson, but bit stinky. Bit stinky. It's a bit stinky. It's a bit of a shithole. Love your album. It's on Spotify. It has 50,000 plays. Anyway, you can check out my album on Spotify. We're making the music video for it Wednesday. How many, uh, how long till streamers buy and open every old box left? I think the population is still really high, but it is true that it's not a bad idea to hold on to yours because there uh, will never be any more created. It is a finite resource. Yeah. Yeah, we, I play fantasy football. We're literally uh, against each other in the playoffs today for uh, all the marbles. Yeah, I need 16.01 points to squeak it out. Uh, no shot it happens. All right, let me turn you up a bit. Am I still a quiet boy? You're just on mouse, though. I mean, I just talk like a streamer yeah, you, YouTuber all the time. Yeah, you do be screaming. Did you know Jack Sepsky got copyright claimed on his stream yesterday for playing your songs? Did he? What? Oh, I believe that. I don't, I don't think I answered him. Th four of the songs are copyright claimed on YouTube. Yeah, 100%. They're cover claimed. They're claimed as covers because they match the melodies. The ones that aren't claimed are Baby It's Cold Outside. I forgot he streams on YouTube because it'd be different if he streamed on Twitch because I don't think they've, they have they can't claim. Uh, Trader Jericho, think of the 13 months. Almondja, think of the six. Frogatoll Legacy, think of the two months. The lyrics are copyrighted. Uh, can you copyright lyrics? I think, I guess. It's just words. How can you copyright, well, I guess, books? That was dumb. One of these was on UK eBay for 12,000 pounds. Pounds to dollars. Oh, shit. I can't. 16K? That's not bad. Oh, by the way, quick PSA before we start. Stop DMing me to buy your Pokemon cards. Christ, boys. All of you keep DMing me and showing me screenshots of your shitty unlimited cards. <laughs> All right. This guy sent me his pops or tops cards. He was like, I think this one might be an error print or a kid cut it up when he was five. I can't tell. Either way, I'll sell it to you for 6K. I don't want your shitty cards. Put it on eBay. Let the market decide. All right. We're not, we're not doing any deals between us. It was cut like by one of those squiggly scissors that you know those ones that you do like arts and crafts with that the don't come straight ones? line. Yeah. yeah, it was cut with one of those. And they were trying to convince me it was an error print. Uh, Bob Camp, thank you the 10 gifted buddy. Miz got his box on a discount from a viewer. Yeah, I do know that. I do know that that happened. Um, but I, look, at the end of the day, even if you got... It's not worth the bad deals to get to the good deals. Because you guys send me the shit of the shit. Have you seen the video of the base set sheet with four print Charizards? Yeah, I have. It didn't look the best. All right, hold up. Let's do this. Where's Saikuno? Oh, real quick. Should we tell him about it? So oh, yeah. <laughs> last night, last night we order ramen, right? You know, uh, a thing you get when you're in, in LA when Ben's visiting. And so we get ramen uh, and on the note, it said, or on the receipt, it said, check back for a note. And the note said like, um, hey, Ludwig, love the stream. And it followed up with, say hi to Saikuno for me. <laughs> How much you got to love Saikuno? Ben was saying this. For you to see me and think, oh, I could say hi, hi to Saikuno with this. Wh why am I not good enough? What? Dude, it's like when, whenever you come around and someone always asks you about someone else. Yeah. Yeah. They go, how's Megan? How's that's, your girlfriend? I'm like, what about up. me? How am I doing first? Yeah. Let's get baby steps. Right. Anyway, that was hurtful. Now let's take a look at this box. Are we good? Are we good? Everyone ready? I'll open it up. What were we saying about Tucson? Just a bit stinky. <clears throat> Don't feel judged. Too much. All right. Okay, this is her. This is our uh, our our fossil first edition box. Now, look, we've been doing uh, Pokemon Week for uh, a week now. It's just ended yesterday with Ms. Kiff's 
uh, Neo Genesis box where he got his Lugia. It was very hype uh, and a really fun week. But one of the main problems during Pokemon week were the values that we were giving cards. A lot of people had problems with us calling things PSA 10 or how much a card's worth because at the end of the day, it's only worth that if it gets graded by the company that applies that value to the card. So we were going to, uh, you know, just write it off and move on. But I thought we would do a fun little experiment. Enter uh, today. We are opening up a first edition limited print of the Fossil box set. The idea behind this is to keep every single card, get everything I can graded, find out what the grades are, and sell them all on eBay. And I'll see if I make my money back, if I make money, or what I think is most likely if I lose some money at the end. And I'll add everything up. I'll add up how much it costs for this box, which was like $19,000. How much it costs to get everything graded, which will probably be another couple thousand. And how much it costs to ship everything out. The fees eBay takes. All right, how much I have to pay Slime to be the one to package them all up. There's a lot of factors that are going to go into this. And that's what we'll uh, we'll see. And we'll add up everything we spent, all right, our, 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 our losses and everything we made, our, 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 our revenue. And then you'll find your profit loss statement. I don't know. You did business, right? Profit loss yeah, statement. Yeah, for a couple years. Yeah, whatever. Profit loss statement. Something like that. Uh, some nerdy shit. To find out if uh, if this is worth it, or if I'm just losing degenerate amounts of money. This is my Mr. Beast scratch off ticket video. Now this is part one because I think it'll take a while to get everything graded, but at least we can open it all together on stream. Um, before we do that, I'm gonna run three minutes of ads so there's no pre roll. So um, uh, one one moment. The box is kind of fucked. Yeah, she's bent. I'm noticing. Hope this one is on eBay, so it could be a scam. But I kind of doubt it. You seeing that? Just a huge... Oh, you're you're saying like it could be a repackage? Could be. I mean, it seems pretty nice. That'd be funny if it had like some Monopoly play money in it. There's a little tear right here. Just a baby one though. Would that be funny? That would be fucking that hilarious. That would be fucking... It'd be, it'd be <laughs> funny for a bit. And then a lot of headaches. <laughs> I would get a little chuckle. A hearty one. How much would we raise for LACS3? It's a great question. Uh, for LACS3, we have raised $82,567. Wow. So we're doing pretty good. But we are going to 100% start uh, chat versus uh, Ludwig Pokemon tomorrow. Um, we'll definitely get that done. Do you have a list of LACS3 participants? It's online. I don't know where it is. I'll be honest. Slime's done great. I announced it, and then I haven't even thought about the tournament once, and Slime already locked all the players. We've done both of the qualifiers. I think we've locked a lot of our talent and things like that, so. What's my Starbucks order? Coffee with cream and sugar. Want to try it? No, I'm good. Not a big coffee guy. You get fucked up from creamer, right? <laughs> yeah, I just don't really like the taste of coffee. Sure. It's an acquired one. Yeah. Coming from the man who throats beers like no other, that is shocking. Well... Yeah, I'm not throating coffee. True. That's fair, I guess. You should look at the one, uh, 1995 Blastoise Prism card. It's such nice art. Yeah, sure. I'll Google it, buddy. We got time. 1995 was a great year. It was. We great were both born year. that year? Yeah. Wait, that's just the original art. Oh, unless you're talking about this. Are you talking about Top Sun? No, that doesn't say. I don't that's, know that's Christmas Blastoise. Prism is. Yeah, he's a bit festive. Uh, all right. Do I have a mod in chat, by the way? Yeah, let me get in there. Uh, Yeti or Barb's? I'm gonna add you guys to a. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna throw this in the ye chat if you guys are available. All I want to do is keep a tally of every card we got. Um. Actually, I'll, I'll just put it in the group chat. All right, easy. Solved. 
And your tags, it says body painting. Um, yeah, it's just under the clothes. Are we good? Are the ads done? They are. Great. Welcome back. Welcome back. What does wild Pokemon mean? Like in the game? I don't know. What does wild Pokemon mean? Like in the game, you encounter Pokemon in the wild. Is, that, is he asking what do wild Pokemon in the game mean? I suppose. Oh, my channel points reward. Oh. So don't use it, but that will be for when we do um, the... Uh, yeah, sorry. I was doing it last night. Uh, need editing privileges. Okay. Uh, I, I, I was setting up the chat versus me Pokemon. Uh, anyway, boys, so this is all we're going to do today. We're opening the box. We're going to find the prices of everything we get in the box, yada, yada, yada. And then uh, tomorrow we're doing Twitch chat versus Ludwig and Pokemon, where you can use your channel points to choose which Pokemon will be in the wild. Uh, you can also pay to get rid of my health, recover my opponent's health, apply poison, paralysis, get rid of PP, all those good things. And fire red. What time tomorrow? It'll be at 3 p.m. 3 p.m. sharp. PP? All right, I think we're good. I'm, I'm, I'm good to end stalling. Right after I think Audible. <laughs> Guys, exclamation point Audible in chat. Do me a favor. Click on the Audible link. Boys, it's actually one of the best sponsors I've ever had because uh, it's actually valuable for you to use in life. Reading and listening to audio books. Look, I'm lazy as hell. I went through four years of college without reading a single book. End of the 3.4. Don't know how I managed that. Probably would have had higher if I read them. Or listen to them with Audible. Uh, I recommend you guys check out Steve Jobs' autobiography. Actually, it was a, a big game changer for me. Not that he's a huge inspiration, but more so how his life was. I thought he was much more ethereal, but he's kind of a degenerate. And uh, that helped me realize that he's... <laughs> it's not that hard to be Steve Jobs. I mean, not a billion. That's uh, kind of crazy, but the rest of it. Didn't he have cancer? Well, <laughs> yeah, that part. It makes it pretty hard to be Steve Jobs. Uh, no, I'm not saying that he, was, like, he didn't go through... I'm saying that like he wasn't this genius savant. Like he, he was in a way, but if you read it, you find out. He's like he's like a very flawed man, I guess is what I'm yeah. saying. Yeah. Doesn't he credit some of his success to taking LSD? Yeah. That's pretty wild. He definitely I think has a quote that says like you're a coward if you don't take LSD or something <laughs> like that. And I was like, "Damn." <laughs> But uh, anyway, check it out. It's by Walter Isaacson. Uh, you can sign up for Audible right now. If you do, use code Ludwig or click on any of my links. I'd really appreciate it. Uh, at least just click on it and check it out. Uh, anyway, let's let's do this. We got our box. Uh, you want to open it up? Am I your opening guy? I'll do you the honor. It's a fun experience. You got to put it on camera, though. Come on, Jen. Please. Sorry. You're fine, just never again. I'm just trying to treat this like a delicate Bro, you flower. you think that's on camera? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> do you know how awkward it is to like hold yeah, something up? I, and... I do. Thank you for asking. Dude, you... No one ever does. Do you have like a really sharp knife? That's a screwdriver. Gets it done. Okay. We've made contact. Higher, higher. <laughs> Now you got to sniff. Give it a, a sniff, give it a sniff. whiff? Yeah. It smells fresh. That's 20 years old. It's maybe not fresh. <laughs> maybe actually 20 years old. Ooh. Do you smell anything? Am I just fuck What tell, do you mean? Tell I mean tell me what you smell. I smell like a It kind of it's pleasant. It's yeah. it's, it's like a light permanent marker. It's what it's what you'd want your house to smell like, I think. Yeah. It's got a new card smell. Yeah. Man, it did smell different in the 90s. Now that I remember the smell of cards, I feel like I'm not making that up. I was always a Yu-Gi-Oh card opener. Never a Pokemon card really? guy. Never. Yeah, never. But you never had like one sick Pokemon card? No. No? I, I was trying to collect Exodia, my guy. Uh, Alright. Uh, here it is. Got our... Uh, First edition fossil box. Okay, kind of choking this part. 
There's no... Lovely. There's no what? Like, it doesn't matter what's on the front, right? The art? Yeah. Yeah, the art doesn't matter. Yeah. So, like, if you open up Lapras or Aerodactyl, nah, doesn't matter. Nah, there's 36 packs, 12 guaranteed hollows, and it doesn't matter what anything is. Uh, all right, I think we're good to go. I don't think I changed. I'm going to ping my Discord again. I don't think I... Oh, no, I did. Yeah, we're good. Uh, are we ready? I think you start us off. I'll get us started. Um, let me just double check because I have a Google Sheet I'm working on that will have all the prices of the cards. Uh, and it'll have everything we pull. Someone's going to enter every single card we pull? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm paying two mods. I don't know anything about this, but you told me you want to sleeve every card. That doesn't yes. include like energy and shit, right? I would, uh, I would throw the drinks. Yeah, we're fine. Uh, you sleeve literally everything. Really? Yeah. So first edition is the reason why most of these cards are gonna have like some value on them. But even, uh, actually, are there any energies in this? There might be no energies. Oh, there's energy search. There's only 62 different cards in here, and the least valuable one... Wait, you're telling me that the least valuable card is that $44 card? Yeah, that's right. Oh. Damn. Yeah, so the thing about this is, like, this is the second or third... It's the third ever box set ever created from, uh, from Pokemon. And so people like to collect, like... The most popular collections is probably the first one, and then probably the second one, and then the third... You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I get it. It's just like a very popular collection that people want all the cards from. Anyway, uh, let's let's get to it. Are we good? Get it started, brother. Uh, hold <clears> up. <throat> do you want do we do you want a little light music in the background, chat? What are we doing here? I thought you threw on a Pokemon OST. We can do a little pokey and chill. All right. This is our last box ever, by the way. No more boxes after this. You say that now. Yeah, that's a lie. But, I, you know, I just got to say it out loud. How many to the back is it? Do we know? Isn't it normally two? It's normally three. Hopefully that's not the rare. <laughs> All right, we got Magmar. I'll just throw him here for you. Weezing. I do love that slow, bro. Anything sunset. And hey, this is the worst card we could have possibly gotten, but it's 44 bucks. PSA 10. Psyduck. Ekans. Geodude. Bro, you know Ekans is snake backwards. You know uh, Arbok is Cobra. You know Muck? <laughs> All right. Two left. Grimer in our hollow or rare. Oh, shit. Kabutops, holographic. My guy. Off rip, we bink one. Let me get the hard sleeve. Mm hmm. Double wrapper. I, I, don't, I don't know how much this is. I really only know the. The Dragonite's really valuable. That's a the Kabutops, That's a twelve hundred. That's a solid twelve hundred. And that's a ten from my eyes. <laughs> that's what we're doing. This <laughs> <way>. <laughs> we're doing this so we stop doing that. <laughs> All right. Well, I didn't get scammed on the packs then. That's good. It does look pretty money. But again, the whole idea of this is that we're gonna get everything graded. That tape is on the the sleeve, by the way. Uh, but we're going to get everything graded and see the value. But the centering is really money. The cornering seems great. Not too much whitening. I don't really see any, actually. I don't know if chat sees any hollow lines, but you guys are kind of the experts at it. <laughs> they actually see it every time. Really? Yeah, I don't know. Because I think there's just 20,000 people, and there's always just one person. Some guy's going to call it out. Yeah, they just catch it. This is actually the worst hollow I've ever seen, though. And what do you mean? Like, you don't like the art? Yeah, it just kind of looks like that word art you would use in, like, fifth grade. Like that red one. When you do the, the gradient. Yeah. It's just a bit weak. It does look very money. How do you want me to stack these? Does that matter? Uh, it doesn't specifically matter, no. 
Okay. But, you know, just keep them, keep them, keep them together. So Relatively you know. organized? Oh, you know what, actually? What? Um, can you grab those? Just put them in that. That's like a, like a bigger bag to put them in. Oh, we triple wrapping. And just shove them all in there until it's... Do you want me to keep the hollows separate? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so we can show them off at the end. All right, next pack. We'll just swap off every few. Yeah, you can go again. I'll get the next one. Do you think Ludwig goes back and reads the chat when the stream's over? Are you out of your goddamn mind? <laughs> you think I'm live six hours and then I go uh, watch my stream for another six hours? Read six hours of chat. I don't even read you while I'm live. I used to do that with commentary. Well, that's because you're trying to improve as a commentator. True. I guess it's not a good way to improve at streaming by reading chat. No. They're always wrong. All right, Ghastly. Sandslash. I don't really know what the good commons here are. Let me check. It's always the little guys like uh, Squirtle and shit. Yeah, right? I don't think there are any Squirtles in this, though. No? Yeah. Damn. So uh, the, the good ones is like Raichu, Slowbro, Mr. Fuji. Psyduck. I think Psyduck is one of the best comments. Mm. Did we get any ducks? I don't remember. Uh, we got a Psyduck, got yeah. Oh, we did? Oh, speaking of. Hello. This is pack number two, yeah. Recycle. Love that. Reduce, reuse. Tentacool. Grimer. Slowpoke. The slowpoke is so weird in the set. They just really threw him off in the distance. Yeah, they don't give a shit about slowpoke. Yeah, yeah, they did not work on that one too much. 55. This one is worth 100 bucks. Horsey. I do like that one. He's got a fat nose. Is this it? No, that's not a hollow, is it? That is a hollow. No! <laughs> had, shit! Had to be muck. Come, dude. This is the <laughs> worst hollow in this set. This is $433. It's the least valuable holographic card you can get. I don't know why muck gets so much hate, bro. Because he's a fucking ugly card that spells comeback. <laughs> Damn, that is a shame. People like me would pay top dollar for come backwards. Uh, look. Centering bit off it actually looks pretty money though i think the what i've noticed is that box sets kind of um they kind of have like themes like if you have bad cornering a lot of the cards will be bad cornering in the set if you have bad centering a lot of the cards will be bad centering in the set it's not like one-offs so i think that's what i uh i look for a lot Get me that just five. Don't get me those ones because they have the tape on them. What? They're right next to it. At that. Yeah, no, right above it. Yep, yep, yep. Two hollows already on the top two packs. Yeah, that's kind of crazy. That decreases my chances of pulling a hollow drastically, right? Oh yeah, on our what's our game we're doing? Uh, pull one, keep one. Pull one, keep one. Yeah. Where's the um, the baggie? Right here. Oh no, I meant I meant this thing. Oh, you just grab one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Until sure. you said until it fills up. Yeah, yeah, you can just keep showing them in there. I left the side up on the side because, or should I just throw it in the mix? I can just throw it in the mix. All right. If it's not the rare, because we'll have a count of everything we have, so it's not like we need to count them up at the end. All right. Oh, you got homeboy on the case. Yeah, I got two homeboys on the case. All right. All right. Uh, this is my last one, and then you go. Did I shower today? No. No shot. Dude, that was sweet. Some guy was wishing you luck. Thank you, buddy. That's sweet. There's some nice ones in chat. Yeah. Do you know Kimball? What's Kimball? I don't know. Did I fuck up something? What do you mean? Kimball these nuts. <laughs> Kimball. Kim, Kimball. <laughs> I don't think it plays like that. No? What'd you get me with? Sukuman? <laughs> yeah, Sukuman. Nice. Sukuman ramen. Sukumi nuts.
All right, Golem. That's a good one. Ooh, I do like Cloyster. That's got to be a money. That's Tom's favorite Pokemon. Oh, yeah? Yeah. 32. Cloyster, $100. Golbat. It's a pretty fire Golbat. Energy search. Least valuable. Love it. <laughs> Another Psyduck, though. Kind of just banking him. Ekans. You know, it's Snake Backwards. Yeah. Geodude. Ammonite. Two left. Gambler. And our final card is not a Grimer. There's one more. Final card is a Magneton non holo which is 122. PSA 10. Yeah, just take him out. That makes more sense. Thanks, guy. Not bad. You want the non hollows to be juicy because you have 24 guaranteed non hollows. I think better ones are the Dragonite non hollow, the Articuno, the Zapdos, the Moltres. I want all the legendary birds if I can get them. I mean, theoretically, you could finish an entire box set on one, like, in one entire art set on one box right like get all the cards you're saying you think you could pull every single every card, card? in these 36 packs yeah is that crazy i don't see why not there's 366 cards there's only 62 different ones i think you have a better likelihood of pulling about 10 energy searches though no i can't because there's 16 hollows good call all right you want to take over yeah i'm in You gonna tilt me? Boom. You got a close up. Alright. My luck is shit, by the way. Uh, yeah. What's the, uh, the Strat. trick? The trick. Don't you, like, pinch it or something? No, you, uh. Oh, there it is. You got it? I think I got it. I also lack fingernails. Yeah, I come on today. You just gotta, uh, you know. You got it. It's a bit of a sweat. I would just hate to damage Raise the, uh... Bit, right? So you just, you go like this, right? You, you do this, pull it, and then you just kind of, like, keep picking at this. Until, until it comes loose? Like, you'll have, like, you know, like a little area to do it. It's way easier with nails, but eventually you'll get that, and then you're good. So you count to three and then put it at the end? Yeah, you don't have to put them like, you can just either do one, 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 or one, two, three all at once. It doesn't really matter. Uh, but just put them up to the, you're staring at this because you need to have, beautiful. Just excellent pack opening. You go, flawless, could reseal that. Oh, dude, what? 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 <laughs> yeah. what? What? You just leaked it. Did I leak it? Yeah, you leaked it. Dude, I, I was tr having trouble counting to three. <laughs> How do you count to you three? Just pull one. So you just pull like, so you just grab one. Yeah. And then do that two more times. And that's how you pull three. Oh, so you pull from the top, not the bottom. You could just like, like just, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Now one more. One more. <laughs> I think it's a hollow Gengar, but we'll see. And now you just go through. Okay. So you got, you got Seedra. You're shaking a bit. Nervous? I'm just, yeah. All right. You got Seedra. I would hate, hate to damage this hollow Dragonite. It would be a shame. Yeah. But I can tell you it's not a hollow Dragonite. Little Sandy guy. Seen quite a few shelters. Tentacool. Another very pathetic looking slowpoke. Very lonely. Zubat. Pause champ. You hate to see the sad Jigglypuff. Yeah, there's no cool Jigglypuff in this one, I don't think. Are you telling me pause champ? Does that mean stop? No, no, no. It just means like waiting, like holding your breath for something exciting to happen. Mm. Pausing in anticipation. I see.
Kabuto. Right, this is it. This is it. This, this is, is the it. one. Yeah. Oh man. What'd you pull? Beep. Oh. oh that's actually a huge card. That's a bink. That is, uh, I think it's the second most valuable card in this. I've been bending it too. Yeah, look at the uh, the warping, just from it being hollow, because over twenty years the hollows they bend and warp. Oh yeah. Chad, what are we thinking? Do you see any hollow lines? What's going on here? This card's dope. Yeah, I like that. You know, it was such a cock tease. When what? you when you used to play the Pokemon games and you couldn't get Gengar. Yeah, I think having it being locked to like friend trades was kind of crazy. Yeah, that was such a tease. Chat, I'm not asking for you to grade it, you <laughs> fucking degenerates. You I'm gonna go to PSA, alright? I can't just screenshot my Twitch chat saying nine, print that out and call it a day. Good poll. Let's check her PSA 10. We have one of these baggies, by the way. Another? Just get a little collection on uh, Alright. I guess I'll get all the baggies. Yeah, you should just grab them. <laughs> alright, Ben. You can get another pack. Off to an absolute flames start. You did start off quite talented. All right. We already got three hollows in four packs, though, which is kind of crazy. It's kind of not good, right? It doesn't matter. It's just about, like, the hype, you know? Just leaves a lot to be desired at the end. The way we're doing this is... All for uh, for science. The Gengar's value PSA 10 is $2,450. It is the fourth most valuable card in this set behind the Dragonite, Articuno, and Lapras. It has... You can do this, by the way, you don't do it on screen. The three to the back, it's easier. Like, just bring it down. And you just, just grab one, two, three. Right here? Sorry, we're injecting the, the hollows, so it's more hype. The nines of the Gengar are sold for about 500-ish. And a 2,500 seems pretty static for the uh, tens. All right, we got Arbok. We got, all right, you got you to keep it together there, brother. Hey, hey, hey. Leaked a little bit. It was a tiny leak. It was a tiny leak. It was, we know it's a water type. It could be a Lapras. No. It's blue. Could be an Articuno. Is Hollow Lapras pretty juice? Hollow Lapras is the second or third best uh, Hollow, yeah. You would one up yourself. Impossible. <laughs> no one can one up yourself, not even you. Not even me. It's fair. What's up with Horsey just polluting his uh, habitat? I think he stands for like, he's the oil companies. Damn. It's like Princess Mononoke. Oh, he bet. She loves iron. <laughs> but she loves the forest. I just watched, uh, we just watched Princess Mononoke last night. Good movie. A little crabby. What other commons are there other than Psyduck? That are good? Do you know? Uh, yep. I have the list. Psyduck's a good one, but there's a few others. Oh, shit. It is a Lapras. Yo. That's it. That's the card. Oh. You got a Lapras. It's not a Hollow, which is uh, a bit of a shame because a Hollow Lapras is worth a you lot. You want her? It's, uh, it's a very good card, nevertheless, because, uh, again, we do get a guaranteed 24 non-Hollows. And uh, first edition Lapras non-Hollow is 230, 228. Uh, this looks pretty money. Again, I don't think I've seen much whitening. I think a little cornering here. <laughs> We're good. A little magic act in the top. Yeah, you guys see that? I'm sure. A little whitening here. 
Pretty good though. Dude, the chat's loving my pulls. I mean, you pulled like a god. Uh, let's do one more for you. And then I'm taking over. Yep, yep, yep. No I, leaks this time. I think it's a thing in the Pokemon community to lift while you open. Or at least when you open it, to always keep it on camera. Cause so, they, like, so there's no funny business? Yeah, there's no injecting to uh, increase your pull rate or make it more hype than it should be. Let's see. Yeah, a few, uh, few marks in it. But look, it's not a big deal, to be honest. Um, marks are inevitable. It's more so seeing what, uh, you know... What it looks like. Oh, we got a pretty nice spreadsheet going on right now. We got a Mr. Fuji. That one's actually super valuable. Yeah, that you were talking, Mr. Is, Fuji. Uh, 152 common as a PSA 10. Then we got Cloyster. He's a good one. Kingler. Little Kingler. I do fuck with I do fuck with the Kingler and the Cloisters. They did the water types right in this one. Ammonite's art's beautiful. He's like an ancient Rome. What was it? The dome fossil and the... What was the other fossil? Wait, what do you mean? Oh, in this game? It yeah. Was, uh, it was Ammonite and it was uh, Kabuto. The Helix? Yeah, the Helix. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. The Helix and the Dome. Were you a Dome or a Helix uh, man? Dome as an adult because it was funny. and Because you kid, like getting Dome? Helix. Yeah. I see. It's very clever. <laughs> it's, so it's like a joke because it also means like, you know, like head. Yeah. But it's like a fossil. Why are you again. explaining this to me? That's why it's funny. It's like I'm making a funny joke. Oh. I feel like you didn't laugh, so I'm just... <laughs> I Wait, was... Stop focusing on you. What? There you go. There you go. Nice. Juicy. Getting a little arm workout in. It's hard to keep them up. Yeah. Tired of seeing this goddamn slowpoke, though. I think even the Zubat looks better than that slowpoke. Yeah. You know, I hate Zubat. All right. Last one. Last one. This is the juice. You got the juice coming up. Here it is. Oh, <laughs> ditto. I feel like that's probably a pretty good one. Ditto is 155. Not a bad rare. The really good one would be a Dragonite uh, or any of the birds. Any of the legendary bird cards? Yeah, the Mole Trace is worth the least for some reason. As uh, non-hollow. I'm going to go blow my nose real quick. Yeah, go for it. Not bad at all. I'm just packaging things up nicely, trying to keep it all good. Uh, all right. Oh, the camera's not even on me. Yo, what up? Oh, let's bring it right here. How's it going? Thank you for the sub, by the way. Shanks and uh, Mr. Cryconator. Mr. Mr. Chickenator. Sub for 20. Mr. Chickenator, what was your name? There's no way that I have had a sub for 27 months whose name is Mr. Chickenator. And because I've never seen that in my life. That's a that's a <laughs> that's a name you'd remember. Yeah, I would remember Mr. Chickenator. I know I don't think my subs, but I did not go 27 months without realizing I have a Mr. Chickenator sub. It's Chico? Why are you Mr. Chickenator? No, it's Mr. Chiconator. Oh. Oh my god. Did you take Spanish? No, you took French. Chico? Like Chico Chico means like boys. Like kids. In oh, Spanish. So Mr. Kids? <laughs> No, Mr. Like Nader, like Mr. Kid Destroyer. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> all so bad. <laughs> all right, we'll work on that. We'll work on that. We'll work on that. Sure, 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 sure. Um. Anyway, uh, we got our next pack. That's not the origin. I would hope not. You're good, bud. I'm sure there's a brilliant origin to that name, like Ludwig. All made up names. And Onder. All right, it's all right. Your time to shine. It's again. going down. 
We got slow bro. How much is slow bro? I think I already checked, but I think it's a good one. I think slow bro is 189. So it's right next to the side duck, one of the most valuable commons. Golem 132, pretty good. Kingdra. Whoops, kind of fucking dropped that one in some water. That's Seedra. That's what I meant. Yep. Kabuto. Horsey. Dude, you're putting them on the sleeves. Yeah. Ekans. Energy Search. I feel like we've gotten a lot of those ones. Kingler. Two left. Geo, dude. Okay, Gambler, there's one more left. This is a perfect card, love it. Shuffle your hands into your deck, flip a coin, if heads, draw eight cards, if tails, draw one card. That's an insane play. I was gonna say there's some irony in pulling Gambler as your last card. There's one more. Oh. Oh, <laughs> thank God. <laughs> Holy shit, that would've been miserable. Another hollow cum. Yeah, <laughs> two hollow cums is a good way to fucking end stream. <laughs> Not the best. Uh, a muck first edition is worth. Oh wait, four thirty. Oh no, that's hollow. You started out hot. One then, then you went down. Yeah, I did start off two hollows. Look, we need a, a lull so I can, you know, save it for the end. That's true. For the content. It is crazy, Mizkiff. So, people were asking me if it was planned. You were right, or Aiden was. I asked if it was planned. It was his legit like last hollow. Yeah. Sometimes the streamers just get lucky. Trust me, no streamer is, um, like, Mizkiff is way too lazy to have planned that out. To, like, weigh the packs, know the order or something, or open it up and reseal it, no shot. Is that a thing where all packs are ordered? No, no. like, you can predict where the hollows will be. Because there's this, uh... There's th one box set where that happened, and yeah. it was a huge problem. Really? Be went really mad. Well, there's this uh, there's this guy I watch on YouTube, and he was ripping uh, rookie cards, like okay. 1980s rookie cards, yeah. and um, the most valuable would be like Michael Jordan, right? Yeah. And some I was reading the comments after he pulled the Michael Jordan, and the guy's like, I I know this is legit because of the order of the cards. Sure. Like the way they went down is yeah. the same order all the time. I I guess in a way you could like if you opened up a. Nah, you wouldn't. No, no, no. no. I, I, I think it's all random, yeah. Yeah. You didn't do it on stream. No, oh, they're good. Where's your more? Where's more sleeves? Uh, we have a bunch of packs on the ground and over there and around. All right, we got Magmar, who I do like. Uh, what's a Magmar? Wait, I have this spreadsheet. I should just use this. Uh, Magmar is 152. God damn. Uh, 48 PSA 9. Ghastly. I can just organize by this, right? Graveler. What do you think about that art? I love anything Sunset. He looks kind of goofy, doesn't he? Graveler? Yeah, a little bit. He does have his, you know, he's got his legs out. He like reminds he's me. He's at the gyno. He reminds me of the deer god. You think he's at the gyno? <laughs> the deer god from... Uh, Mononoke. Yeah, Mononoke. The Mononoke deer god was a bit goofy. Your favorite? Why is that my favorite? The big one. The most valuable non or common is Slowbro and then Psyduck. And then Sand Slash. Alright, two more. We got Shelder. And our final card is not a Zubat. There's one more. And our final card is Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl Damn. first edition. Not the Hollow, which would have been pretty juicy uh it is the regular which is worth 152 and uh aerodactyl man what a weird pokemon why I feel like compared to everyone else it's just like dinosaur he kind of looks like an old man 
He does have a bit of old man face. He's got a long face. That looks pretty money. Uh, for PSA 10, it was 150. For PSA 9, it was 107. It's deviant art. A bit. I kind of like. It's kind of weird drawing ship that is flying. They just look a bit goofy. All right, predictions for tomorrow. Oh wait, do I get predictions tomorrow? The 15th, I'm supposed to, we'll see. We'll see if it actually happens. What's the best thing I've pulled? Uh, I've pulled a dark Charizard, but it was pretty bad quality. I think it would hypothetically be the most valuable. I pulled a Dragonite, that was pretty good. Uh, what else? I pulled a reverse holo Charizard. Calling a holo Articuno. All right, Bamboozled, you want to put your life on the line? I'll ban you if it's not it, and I'll VIP you if it is it. How sure are you? All right, we got Graveler. Tentacruel. Is it blue? I don't know. I didn't see much blue. Cloyster. Tentacool. Horsey. Mysterious Fossil. Atkins. He said to run it. Uh, might not be the best decision. My guy. Grimer. Shelter. Lot of blue. Keep it blue. Bro, no hollow no hypno. Way. Not even close. But uh, at least you called a hollow. A holographic hypno. Oh. Not a very good yeah, that's hollow. Not, that's not gas. Yeah, this one is um, the second worst behind Muck. <laughs> but not bad. It's fine. It's 460 PSA 10. I think it's our fourth hollow. One, two, three, our fourth. Or Gengar was a real money maker. Happy to be playing, uh, what's it called? Gambling? No, no, no. Pull, pull it, take it. Oh, yeah. Pull, pull it, one, keep, keep it. One. Pull yeah, one, keep pull one. one, keep one. That is how it is going. Did you ban him? Oh, yeah, mods. Ludwig7 in chat. His life, uh, was short. We'll see you later. Is this full? Or has this got more room? I think after these, you can probably cap her. Actually, no, I can fit more. Yeah. You can fit three, usually. Every time we switch, pretty much. All right. What was his name again? Ban the first person who types in the chat. They're an arc. I'm going to scroll all the way up. All right, some. Jerusalem with the hell, man? Why are you narking in my chat? Bamboozled. Damn. Uh, all right. Let's go next. Is that two or three for you? This is my third right here. All right. You're getting the the hankering. We've knocked down four hollows. Four hollows. We got eight left, but we've only done eight packs. No, yeah, we did eight packs and we got four hollows. Uh huh. Which is uh, pretty high because it should be like twelve packs for that many hollows. I brought back the stash because the guy who's doing our music video said that he'd be good with the stash. I'm like, sure. What do you think about the stash? You've never been much of a facial hair uh, man's. But. What do I think? What do you want? It still looks good. It's not a PSA 10. <laughs> All right, man. <laughs> All right. Let's check it out. We got Cedra. Golduck. First time today, I think. The Golduck is really fire. 
I have this in reverse hollow as well from the legacy pack we opened. Uh, Golduck 150. Pretty juicer. Arbok. Geodude. Recycle. I feel like every pack has one of those. And one of these. Gambler. I'm just going to bulk sell my Slowpokes. Kabuto. Zubat. Energy Search in our Hollow. Holographic oh, Zapdos. God. Damn, we're pulling Hollows left and right. Holographic Zapdos is pretty big. It's $810 for the Holographic Zapdos. Uh, it is the second or third most valuable holographic bird. It's the least. Okay, it's the least valuable. This is how I can phrase that. Dude, you want to know something really cool? What? Articuno. Uno? Wait, it's an error? Wait, what? Wait, how do you how do you know? Top left. This is top left for them. I don't know. Yeah, what's wrong with it? Oh, look at the top left of the hollow. It's just there's there's no hollow. Oh wow, yeah, that's bad. Is that an error or just a, like are we just fucked? That's not good. This doesn't feel like because like you said <laughs> error, and I thought that was a good thing. This feels like a let me call up Island for this one. That's a PSA two. Yo, yo. Island, oh, talk to me. What what the hell is this? Uh, so the the Zapdos from Fossil. Yeah, it so has like a bird there's part. a little there's a little <laughs> cutout, and that cutout is typically done for like evolutions, right? Let's say like you know Blastoise that has a pre evolved form of War Turtle, so they would cut that out. So they accidentally cut those out for Zapdoses, but it's on every first edition card, so it doesn't affect the value of it. Only was corrected in unlimited version later on. Oh, so it's literally all the cards have them. Yeah. Every first edition, uh, yes. Oh, I see. So you're saying like, so for example, this Hypno has a drowsy uh, symbol in the top left. Yep. That is where they cut out the hollow oh. so they can put that stamp there. And they mm -hmm. mistakenly, because they're not true Pokemon fans, did that for Zapdos, even though it's a single evolution legendary bird. Correct. Either that or you got a fake box. What? Okay. But I mean, like either, either way, you're okay. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, man. Uh, appreciate the info. Anytime. You need anything? Uh, I'm always here. Yeah, I'll call you up. All right. Peace. Good luck. <clears throat> Feels good, man. Island does have the info. Potato chips. Thank you for the two months. Finally moist. Thank you for the prime. All right. Your turn, bud. I feel like we got to keep one upping each other. Uh, you currently are still in the lead. Oh, is the Zapdos not equivalent to the Gengar? Not even I wasn't close. paying attention. Zapdos is the least valuable one because it's been reprinted a bunch. All right. We do have a juicer. This is a neat way to pack him. He's going pro. All right, everyone pause champ for Ben. He's gonna get it done. Just lost my touch. There she goes. So right now we've opened up uh, five hollows in nine packs, which is kind of crazy because we have almost uh, half our hollows remaining. And uh, already I'm checking. So we've plugged this into a spreadsheet that calculates the PSA 10 and the PSA 9 pricing. PSA 9, it's already 6,000. And so the whole idea behind this is to get every single card graded and then sell them all and see how much we make. So let's let's find out. 6K is actually not that great, to be honest, because we're about a third of the way to uh, our goal of breaking even. <laughs> it's actually pretty bonk. For, uh, for over a third of our hollows, it's kind of tough. But we just need to bank a good hollow. Just scoot up a bit, bud. Make your arms do a lot. Uh, hopefully we get predictions tomorrow. I'm supposed to. Alright, you got wheezing? Just throw him here. Ghastly. Love a Ghastly. Kingler. Little Kinger. 
Who's your favorite uh, Gyarados. Pokemon from this? Oh, from these? Yeah, the Gyarados. Uh, yeah. Uh, be Dragonite. That's a good one. Gyarados is a good one, too. I'm actually surprised there's no Gyarados. I guess Do... he was in Jungle, right? I don't know. I know he's in Gen 1. Base set. He is a Gen 1. Brings a tear to my eye every time, man. Just the Jiggly, poor puff. Jigglypuff getting recycled. Hey, you banked a side that, That's another duck. I feel like we've gotten a lot of ducks. Yeah. Uh, by the way, Yeti, instead of doing half tens and half nines, do all the hollows nines in the commons tens. Okay, I think this is my moment. All right, we need the hollow Dragonite. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, tough day. <laughs> Thank God it's not a hollow, but Christ. We brought him up one time and he just keeps coming back. I'm, I'm not even top loading him. We should just throw our mucks away. <laughs> It'll save us time and money. <laughs> exactly. All right, you go next. This is my friend Ben, who's visiting, and his car broke down, so it's taken a day to repair, and he's here, and I thought we'd open up some Pokemon packs, which is why we're doing this today instead of chat versus Ludwig Pokemon, which is what we're going to be doing tomorrow, boys. So uh, stay tuned for that. It'll be 3 p.m., Ludwig versus Twitch chat in Pokemon Fire Red. You guys, with your channel points, can control the Pokemon I run into, and with your money, control how I do in the game. Removing my HP, adding it to the, the trainers. Uh, adding poison onto me. Whatever you want. Bunch of shit. Still got there. She really hates it. There she goes. Oh, there she is. That will be on YouTube, I yeah. I feel like we haven't seen this guy yet. Amistar, yeah. Got a lot of Ammonites. I don't... I actually don't know if we have seen an Ammon. I'll look it up. It's a little Magmar. Yeah, we have not gotten on Amistar. That's our first one. We're still missing the original Hypno, the Graveler. Oh, no, we haven't had a bunch of Gravelers. Yeah, you made a gynecology joke. True. That did hit. Yeah, I was pretty hype. Predictions? I don't have them yet. Maybe tomorrow. All right, think two more. Mm -hmm. We're getting there. Kabuto. Show me an Articuno non hollow. That's not that. Oh, there's one more. I think so. All right. Yep. This is it. This is it. Oh, Kabuto. Hit on, on Lee. Lee. That's kind of a cool one. He kicking. Yeah, he is kicking. You want him? Yeah, I want him. Let me sleeve him. Hitmon Lee is worth uh, 787 hollow. The non hollow Hitmon Lee is worth 117. Are you Hitmon Lee or Hitmon Chan guy? Lee, for sure. Really? I'm a soccer boy. True. Be kicking. Why is it? It's your head. It keeps wanting to focus on your head. I got a big old head. Yeah, that's a pretty cool card. I feel like it'd be a lame hollow. All right. Go next. Wait, you've done how many? Mm. You've only done two, right? Yeah. Got a text from my cousin saying oh, yeah. that saying that he could take me. Like fight me. Randomly? Well he's watching the stream. What? So I just want to tell him he's wrong. Why was that his reaction to seeing you on a stream is that he could beat you in a fight? Uh I don't know. That's... He's kind of an aggressive man. Yeah, that's an aggressive that's an aggressive thing to jump to. I just want him to know he's wrong. I feel like most people would be like, hey, bud, saw you on stream, but he just said I'd beat you in a fight. Well, he said take me. That sounds sexual. Well, he... I no. guess you are from, <laughs> you know, Canada. Yeah, you know, where they get the south sexual. south of the north. Worst card in the deck, love it. Is that the energy search? Yeah. My guy. I love binking Damn. ducks, dude. Do bink ducks. 
Ducks and uh, the, what's the other one we need? We need a slow bro. You know what you need? What? You need a what's it called? A mat? No, you put your uh, mouse pad. No, you put your drink on it. Coaster? Yeah, coaster. That's, uh, that's what, what a mouse pad's for. Oh. How much have we raised for charity for LACS? 82.5K, but we're going to probably hit 100K with the thing we're doing this week. And then I think we're going to raise a lot of money during the tournament itself. So hopefully we smash it. You didn't put three to the front? I think you did. Oh, I didn't. Fuck, you didn't pull three from the back right no. now? No. Just, just, no, no, just slide them out. All right, you can do that. It's fine, yeah. A, a hero in chat. Yeah, that was heroic, whoever did that. My God. Oh, is that the bro? Oh, damn. That's, Slow bro and a side up. That's a bro. That's a beautiful card. Most valuable common. Worth more than most rares. And Sand Slash. I think... This is a fire one. Sand Slash is like 150. I got two more. Oh, of I course. This is the one. He's I was literally... I was, is dumb dude, I was literally one away from goofing. Here we go. Oh! Oh, Ooh. shit. A holographic oh. Aerodactyl. That's $1,200. My guy. Pretty good card. And that means we have uh, gone through half of our hollows in this box. Uh, can you throw these? Yeah, I'm going to... Yeah. Wait, what do you want me to do with this? Throw the, the commons in there. Okay. Throw it in there. Yeah, I will. I'll show it to you in a second, boys. There's top loading it this is it we got a holographic aerodactyl pretty good hollow better than the the muck at least all right bro you gotta stop focusing on ben's head there you go i'm seeing do you see that right next to the the one there's a hollow imprint kind of like mizzy's card had where's the one the 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 stamp Oh no, that's just the uh, no, that's the actual. No, that's the actual card. Never mind, it's good. I thought that there was a little uh, line right there, a little a little speck, but it's, it seems fine actually. Uh, let's check the back. We got pretty fucking beautiful corners. Nothing on the edges. Pretty good. I don't know. Do you see any uh, print lines or anything, chat? Is there a swirl? Oh, I do kind of see it, but it's not a hollow swirl. So I don't think it's the... It's just like it might be the art. Yeah, it's just the art. All right. Good shit. Uh, all right, boys, we're at the halfway point. Now it's time for um, a, a, a quick break. Hold up. I got to show you guys something. Is this NordVPN? Um, nope. This is uh, um, Meet America's new favorite uh, sitcom commercial. Uh, which is this right here. Boom. Hold on. I got to figure this out. One second, chat. One second. Pause, chat. Do you want me to organize some shit? We're a bit hectic. No, yeah, where's where's your trash? Uh, I don't got one here. Sure. There's a bag upstairs under the kitchen sink, though. I'll get one. All right, boys. Uh, this it brought to you in part by uh this video. Check it out. Now they're just one family. Trying to get by They're just one family Constantly asking why The one family And they're stuck inside together One family In this dusty old cabin Slash yard forever They're just a mom And a dad And some kids That actually seem pretty uninterested And don't forget him Good old Uncle Ben Trying to keep from going Into a total tailspin Thankfully they've got new Sonic Uh, anyway, 
Boys, uh, Meet America's new favorite sitcom family uh, in a commercial that is uh, The Finchers, the weirdest, funniest, most eccentric sitcom family to hit screens in decades. First two episodes are available to stream live now. The family is abnormal, and you can watch for a chance to win all sorts of ViewSonic products. Cool. Wow. Let's check out our next boxes. Or packs, I should say. Yeah, it was a bounty. What else you got? Uh, For trash? Sh potpourri, man. Yeah. She gets a bit full after a while. Here you go. All right. What do we got? How we tracking money wise? Oh, I can double check. You guys want to see an update? Uh, what do I want? Uh, what's the one that's not new? It's New Leaf. New Leaf. Uh, so boys, this is where we're at right now. Uh, this is the document. It keeps track of all of the uh, things we've pulled. Uh, so as you can see, we have uh, pulled um, 19,000 worth of cards if they're PSA 10, 7,000 if they're PSA 9, and if all of the uh, hollows were PSA 9 or the commas were PSA 10, which is the most common thing to happen because um, the hollows usually have hollow lines or whatever reason, it'd be 10K. We're trying to break even at 30. We're trying to see uh, a well, no, a break even is twenty. Oh, okay. So we're we're like maybe a little under halfway there, I think. But we've also pulled half our hollows, right? We have pulled half our hollows, but we do have like if we just get the Dragonite, that's pretty juicy. It sounds to me like we're on track. We are on good pace. Is this me or you now? Did you just go? You're, I that was my final pull. Okay, the okay, it's the me. hollow Aerodactyl. All right, let's see what I got. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is we'll have the estimated amount of money we'll make, and then I'm going to tally up how much I spend on shipping, on fees. I'll, I'll, I'll count everything. Boom. So basically, you're not going to break even. Well, we'll see. That's the whole point of this. Because if everything comes back PSA 10, then technically we already broke even, which would be kind of crazy. Uh, I'm going a little fast. Hold up. We got you're Graveler, good. Golem, Arbok, Slowpoke, Geo Dude. We got the whole set. I do love when you got a set. Horsey. Recycle. Mysterious Fossil. Ammonite. Is this it already? No, it's too late. Are they did you three from the back? Tentacle? Yeah, I did, I did. And our last one is. A Moltres! Non-holographic, which as I said earlier is the least valuable non-hollow legendary bird. So I pulled the least valuable hollow legendary bird, Zapdos, and this is the least valuable non-hollow legendary bird, Moltres. Uh, it is only valued at 150 or 160 compared to Zapdos uh, or Articuno, which is 460, and Zapdos is 300. You're so. telling me a duck is more valuable than a trace? The, yeah, the, the literal Psyducks are worth more than this Moltres. That's a shame. It is a shame, and I don't know why I'm top loading it as if it was valuable. Because <laughs> we've just discovered it is not. We're just top loading all our uh, final cards that aren't muck. Yeah. Mucks get ripped in half. We give them to Soda Poppin. <laughs> Did you see what happened? No. Did he rip a card? He uh, bought a box and then just tortured the cards. He would like have a wheel of death and put it in lube and shit. <laughs> uh, Sand Slash, that's a big one. Arbok, Kingler. I feel like Kingler's an OP card. How does uh, Evolution only have 10 more health, though? He's still a crab at the end of the day. True. These cards are all useless in competition because of how much they've increased the health of cards. Grimer, Energy Search. Horsey. Is this it? Oh, Lapras. Holographic Lapras. Articuno. Ammonite. Okay. Great, great, great. Is this it? <laughs> Purple. Gengar. Haunter. Haunter, Haunter. non-hollow. 
pretty happy with that because I already have a holographic haunter and it's not one of the more valuable ones. But this is a really good rare. It's $313 for a non hollow haunter. So pretty good there. This couldn't be used in any format. Maybe, you know, Wizards of the Coast only format. This is why the 1 billion lions would win. I do think they would win. Have you thought about this one? One billion lions? One billion lions versus all the Pokemon. Like one of each Pokemon. Like from the anime? That's the, that's where the problem lies, is people don't know. Some I, say I mean, anime style, some say the game version. All it would take was one Pokemon that could fly. What? Because the flying Pokemon would have to come down to attack. No, if you have, if you've ever played Pokemon Stadium, I'm pretty sure there's legendary Pokemon that are just always in the air. Also, like like Dragonite. Okay, a Rattata can hit a flying Pokemon. Well, yeah, but Rattata is also a Pokemon. A Lion is not a Pokemon. Sure, but like, what ability does this Pokemon have? Have you seen lions? They're lazy. <laughs> They're not jumping. Yeah, but a Rattata jump. You think a lion wouldn't jump, but a Rattata can? I can I can use a, a Magikarp to hit a normal type or flying type Pokemon. This guy said that lions would make a ladder, and that's a good that's the a lion good, that, ladder is the worst argument. That's a good point. It sucks that that guy's on my side. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got Weezing, Arbok, Cloister, Kabuto. Ammonite, Arceus is a literal god. Then why can my net level 99 Rattata one shot a level one Arceus? Tentacool, Energy Search, Side Duck, Bink another duck. Slowpoke, two cards left. Geo dude. <laughs> oh, a Moltres again. Non hollow though. Another 165 of yeah, the books. Yeah, that's the equivalent of pulling a duck, bro. Yeah, that's true. I guess I shouldn't pop off then. Oh, you got a duck. I did get a duck. I didn't realize you got one. Yeah, but for real though, if Moltres took air or Lugia took the air, the, thing the, is, the only thing they have on their side is a lion ladder. I think everyone jumps to the movie version of the Pokemon. What, what else are you supposed to do? You That's our only visual representation we have of games. Pokemon. The games? Yeah. So it'd be like Trainer Ben they have like throws computer. out one billion lions. <laughs> yeah. And then you have to fight them. I don't know, man. Are you not letting me do this? Uh, I was just helping. Oh, thanks for the help. Is that offensive? No, it's all right. I'm just a little slow. Nothing wrong with that. This is zoomed in on the forehead. You mean five? Damn. My guy. All right, quick ad break. Be right back. I got to piss. Uh, Moz, do a pull. Pull it one time for the one. You got me those. Hmm. These? Those fatties in the back. No, the cards are cards. Dude, it'd be easier... Uh, maybe it wouldn't be easier if we just switch seats. <clears throat> How many cards we already have? 300 cards is so many. Got a bit of a pile for me. Alright, um, your turn, bud. I gotta piss, though. Let me sneak oh, out. You want me to wait for the ad to be done, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, guys? Ludwig 2? Better than being Slime's friend.
Ludwig Jr. Jr. Manly or Ludwig? That is true. Yeah, someone said Manly Ludwig. I mean, no. We don't have to bring it up to them. There's an intelligent individual in the chat who also brought up the point of earthquake as a move. Yeah, but what about a Pokemon earthquake? Because what if... Who's a who's a really hype ground type Pokemon? You also factor in Dynamax. These guys are on it. Also, these arguments. What, then the like like someone like always likes to bring up. People always like to bring up the fact that like uh, Macargo is uh, meant to burn at a billion degrees and that it would eviscerate all of the. Uh, lion. Yeah, there's also... Okay, so look at it this way. You'd assume because a, a billion lions are just regular lions, they're also just normal type, right? Because they're yeah, normal. That's what I assume. And, and ghost is invulnerable to lo uh, to normal. That's true. And so, that's why the ghosts run out of PP and then they kill themselves. From, oh, from struggle? From struggle, yeah. All right, advent calendar time. Cutie gave me this advent calendar. Is it candy? No, it's socks. Oh, I like that. Yeah, it's pretty hype. I've been cracking it. I missed a few days, though. All right, let's see the socks today. We got reindeer. Good pole. All right, man. All you... All right, time to make it happen, guys. Let me get closer. Get nice and close. Also, zoom in on you. Look at that. Hey, everybody. HD Ben. Man, I'm still so torqued about that Charizard. Yeah, in the Starbucks drive-through, no less. My collection's getting pretty thick. Lovely. Three to the back. All right. Three to the back. All right. Starting off pretty solid with what appears to be a Magmar. It does appear to be a Magmar, which is a very good card for a common. Have we seen a Kingdra? I feel like we've only Kingdra's been rare. getting Seedra. Oh, think a Golbat? We haven't seen one of a, one of those, have we? We've seen a Golbat. Have we? Oh. Yeah, yeah. I guess I have the memory of a uh, what is it? An elephant? Uh, I think their memories are good. I think you mean oh. like a goldfish. Who's, oh, goldfish. Yep, yep, yep. Kingdras get Gen two. Actually, is what I'm finding out. Mm, mm. That adds up. What about moves like Surf and Earthquake? I mean, from that logic, then it would hit the other Pokemon, right? And then they would die from their own... Like, I think the Pokemon would wipe half the other Pokemon out. Earthquake hurts your like, teammates. Earthquake would kill s all the fire types. It would kill literally every Pokemon that's not flying. Yeah, that doesn't have a Levitate. Yeah. Crabby. And the Lions would live, because there's a billion of them. Everyone's favorite card. Love that $44 gem. I think we're getting to Surf it. Surf hits your own team, yeah. Okay, I think this is the one. All right, Ben, give me something juice. Give me that dragon. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, my goodness. Ben! It's the fucking Dragonite. That's a binker. This is the best card. <laughs> Hold up. Okay, got it. Be safe. Be gentle. Oh, my God. Man, I asked and you just delivered. I was going to ask you, I'm like, what color background is Dragonite? And then I saw the white, and I knew. Yeah, before you could even ask. Yeah. Oh, look at that. What a beaut. 
So this is my second one. I actually bought one pack. I got literally one pack from a box break. Mizkif was doing. He opened up an entire this thing. Yeah. I got one of the packs and it had this exact card, the most valuable card. So That's I have lucky. Two. Yeah, it was for a charity stream. Uh, we got great cornering on the back, aka no white, no chips, no nothing. The edges look good. The centering doesn't look bad. I feel good about it. Pretty clearly leans a little bit to the left. Yeah, a little left. But it doesn't feel atrocious. The real problem is the hollow lines, which... Uh, do, do you have the double sleeve? I don't have it on yet, but it's harder to see through it. Chai, you see anything? Kind of a gorgeous card. Yeah. What a beauty on the tail. Nothing to my naked eye. Yeah, I can't see. There might be a little some, some, but uh, to be honest, I don't see much. <sighs> so again, the whole idea of opening this entire box is to get everything graded and see how much it's worth at the end when we sell it all. And this is uh, going to be probably the most valuable card that we sell if it ends up being a PSA 10. Because this exact card sold on eBay um, not too long ago for Five, no, excuse me, 6,150. Uh, and a the, nine is 1,000, right? Yeah. Yeah. It uh, It's dropped off quite a lot, admittedly, uh, but two sold on the 25th for about five, 6,000. And a nine sold literally last week for about 1,000. So not bad at all. We do, uh, we do like that poll. <sighs> I'm glad we got it. The, uh, the other ones to look for, I guess we could get a second. There's nothing that says we can't. Yeah, I was going to say, is there uh, a chance there's another holographic Dragonite? Yeah, I think there's no rule against it. The card sold for th 6300 um today. Oh, really? Three mucks, we can get at least two Dragonites. I, I I appreciate that thought process. Yeah, that's that's a good sentiment. I would sentiment. like one of the non hollow Dragonites. I'll buy it PSA ten for AK. So I part of this is that I'm not. It'll be anonymous selling, because if I sell it as Ludwig, I think that you guys will just buy it. Um, wow, because you guys are kind of dumb. So I'm gonna try to avoid that. <laughs> Which card have you not opened that you want? I want all of the legendary birds in holographic form. You're wrong about the billion lions? Bro. Slow, bro. Dude, whenever we start out with a good common. Yeah. That's nice. I do like starting out with the slow, bro. That is the biggest juicer. Cloister. Sand, Sand slash. slash. Those are great commons. A mysterious fossil. Just Little. starting off so powerful. Yeah, I like to bring the power in everything I do. Electric. You would say. I am a bit of an electric factory. Shelder. Seen a lot of his dumbass. True. Zubat. Yeah. We're searching. The billion lines would starve to death. Yeah, what if you just stall them? I think this is the one. <laughs> you can't win them all. <laughs> Bro, we pulled so many mucks. Uh, you can't win them all. The fourth muck. You can't win them all, but you can't even win one. Nope. All right, you what again. Do, what do we do to mucks? Uh, fucking bend them in half. Sell them with a shit stain on eBay. It'll <laughs> increase the value. <laughs> Sell it as authentic coasters. It's like, yeah. And then people will find a use for them.
I think that I'm I'm using the PP argument. All the Pokemon would run out of PP before they even get through a, a million lions, and then they would have to uh, be resigned to, uh, you know, uh, struggling until they all self destruct. There's right. no PP. Oh, there's magically no PP in your world. Great. Well, there's no Pokemon that exists. So what are you, what are you I'm saying, saying, man? They're all picking and choosing. You know. So are you. Wow. All right. Yeah, but chill. I want to be right here. Okay. See? All right. Cedra. Talk about the ghost person guy? Yeah. I'm on the... Uh... He loses PP, bro. Yeah, but he just never gets hit, so the lions eventually starve. Struggle kills you. No, you can just keep doing X attacks. Just keep or keep feeding it berries. Oh, uh, you just have so many items. Yeah. You will never have a billion items. Dude, look at the claws on the gold duck. That's one of my favorite I cards. Love I think. The gold duck. Those yeah. look like he's just fierce in the bubble bath. <laughs> Are you fierce in the bubble bath? <laughs> yeah, I get ferocious. Look at that, and his son. Damn, two hitters. Kabuto. Another fucking duck. Cycle. Tentacool. Do you think a billion humans could beat the Pokemon? Uh, I guess, do you well. think the human race <laughs> as it stands could be the Pokemon? I've, I've, in the, an I, I keep bringing up the anime, but like in the anime, doesn't Ash just take a beating from Mewtwo? He does get his ass beat. Yeah. All right. Tentacool. Little grimy but guy. He's also a, like a 12 year old boy. Yeah. Like, if The Rock goes up against Mewtwo. Slowpoke and. Uh, I think. Show me the money! Oh. Oh, no. Oh. oh. Holographic Magneton. It's not hollow, is it? Yeah, it is. Oh, it is. Holographic <laughs> Magneton. Not one of the better hollows in this set. It's about, I think. Uh, let's check. 510 PSA 10. So it's, uh, I think the third worst hollow. We've been to the bottom three Hypno, Magneton, and Muck. Bottom three least valuable hollows. We also got the most valuable, though. That is true. We got the most valuable and the fourth most. We just need to bink like an Articuno. It is pretty hard to go up from there, though. All right. Just get a second Dragonite and we're money. That's true. I pulled one. Now you need to. I guess I am the one that's due. We have also pulled eight hollows, I believe. Pull the Gengar. So we only have four left. Yeah, the Magneton's kind of weak. You want an Articuno? Yeah, I want the Articuno. Yeah. Three thousand six hundred. Also, just looks cool. I guess I'm not keeping any because I'm selling them all, but how many packs are left? At least are like... we like halfway. Uh, go to the table. We got this many chat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, sixteen. Sixteen or seventeen. We're a little over halfway. Tom Brady sucks. Ban me. I I mean, I mean, you can just educate yourself. You know what I mean? If that was me, I'd be putting him away. You know, you think he's the GOAT. He is, yeah. Ben's not a New England fan, by the way. I am a Patriots fan. No, you're not. I mean, not like... Not, not like you, Patriots fan, but... But you're not like a hater. I like Belichick, yeah. He does do things different. Uh, well, all right, we got Kingler... We got Ammonite. You're on the you're on the job. You're on the block. My bad. Or I'm a star. Excuse me. I'm a star. How could I not shine? Kanye West, talking about Pokemon. I'm a star is eighty bucks. So so far the only common card we've gotten all the commons. The only card we haven't gotten. Uh, there's a few more actually. We're missing. We're missing Zapdos, Gengar, Raichu. and Raichu. And then the rest are hollows. Oh, also a Kabutops. 
I feel like that's wrong. Didn't we? No, we only got the hollow Kabutops. Oh. No, I definitely feel like I've pulled a Kabutops. Have I not? It was our first hollow pull. I guess I just need to get a Kabutops in here. Slowpoke. Cloister, Tentacool. Yep, yep, yep. Zubat. Recycle. How many recycles? Ten. More than energy search. Oh, yeah. no, not more, actually. Mysterious Fossil. How many uh, ducks have we pulled, though? A decent amount. Eight. It's pretty good. Kabuto. That's the most common card we've pulled today. And uh, our rare is... Oh, uh, another hollow magneton? Brutal. That is brutal. A back-to-back -back hollow magneton. Uh, cool to get a hollow. It's not the worst one you can get, but it is a $510 card in comparison to uh, the value of another Dragonite if I pulled that. So we only have three left now, three magnetons. It looks pretty money. You mean three hollows? Yeah, we have three hollows left. In in like 17 packs or something. Yeah, these packs. are going to be some uh, disappointing packs. Well, you can still get some good rares. Okay. Like I guess we, we are due for a couple rares. For some, like, some good rares, yeah. They both look pretty good condition, to be honest. Maybe I'll sell them as a bundle. Sextaton. No, that's not where the... Where's the three come from? Ton? <laughs> I don't think so. There's no three? I'm just making it up. It's not like Articuno, Zapdos, Moltres. I thought it was. Like Doug Trio or that, Do -dri Do Drio. That's a good point. Sexaton. <laughs> I pulled a sexaton, bro. You want to keep this with your hollow group? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. What do we got? We got a Seedra. A slow, bro. Nice. Big hit. Big hit. Golduck, imagine Psyduck. Nope. Slowpoke. Psyduck coming though. Nope. Horsey. Energy search again. Psyduck. Damn. Good comments. Golduck, Psyduck, and a slow bro. Ekans. Geo dude. And I believe this is it. No, no, two more. Gambler. What is this? Oh, Ooh. shit! We did need that one. Nice! A Raichu, non-hollow. It's a rare. Uh, the Raichu, if it uh, is hollow, is 1,600. The rare is worth 200 bucks, though. So it's literally just worth as much as the slope. Uh, I, can't, I can't believe that the Psyducks are worth as much as this card. Why? Because this card only comes up once in a pack. As a rare, it's and kind. Of, is it because Psyduck's kind of like a meme? I guess people just like the Psyduck art. Oh. I think this art's sick though. This would be a very cool hollow. I wouldn't mind pulling this as a hollow. Oh shit! Saved. Be safe. Looks pretty good though, all things considered. The really good rare I could get is Zapdos. Oh no, excuse me, not Zapdos. Articuno, or Dragonite, Gengar, Haunter. All of those would be really good. Any of the legendary birds, Zapdos, Moltres, Articuno are good. All right, I believe this is my last one. Yeah, that was your second. Clean pull, great huff. So the, the idea for this box is to open it, grade everything, sell everything. Ooh, another Mr. Fuji. That was our second one, right? That's our second one, yeah. Mr. Fuji, uh, I think like 180. And uh, we got a Cloister as well, which is 102. Amistar, pretty good card. 80 bucks. PSA 10, of course. Grimer. Shelder. Tentacool. Slowpoke. Zubat. Still missing the Kabutops. Recycle. Mysterious Fossil. And our rare is... 
A Zapdos non-hollow. $300 at a PSA 10. Pretty fucking dope card. The fact that we're pulling cards we don't have is something I like. I do like seeing the ones I haven't seen. Can yeah. I get a sleeve? The centering looks insanely good, but I can't tell if it's just because the yellow of the background's bleeding. Oops. These cards have been in really good shape. The best non hollow would be Dragonite. Uh, the Dragonite is worth like 800 But this is 300 bucks, uh, PSA 10. So it's another really good one. All right. Uh, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 14 packs. That doesn't make sense. 14 or so. I'm missing a bit of the game. Oh. <laughs> Next Hollows Articuno, I bet. Feel Bill, how much do you bet, brother? You could put your money where your mouth is. Favorite squirrel legendary? I don't even know what that means. Chipmunk? Alvin? Is Alvin a legendary squirrel? All right, gamer. I'm back. You're the only one pulling anything worth our time. Jarl, thank you for the Twitch Prime. Joshy, thank you for the two months. It's Ackies, thank you for the three months. Brown Cam, thank you for the uh, the Prime faux show. Appreciate it. Toxic spikes equals dead lions. Okay, so you put it somewhere. Let's just say you planted toxic spikes somewhere in the Sahara. And there's a billion lions on Earth. Why do you think that's relevant? It takes away a hundred people. It's irrelevant, dude. A billion's a big number. Thank you, hoodies, Harry. What is that? Technos. That's a tentacle. Oh, that's a tentacle. That's a good looking one too. It's a good looking card. Oh, Look, need... we got some more Fuji in our life. Again? Yeah, a little Damn. Fuji. I do love that Fuji art. Yeah, I do too. He's just cuddling that Pikachu. What is? Getting... What does he do in the Nasty lore? Nasty from. Do you know uh, what he does like in the I... anime? No, I don't. I only know Mount Fuji. Yeah. So I guess he's the Mount Mount's just named after him. He's a he's a daycare man. Breeder, perhaps. Horsey. Snake. <laughs> Sorry. You just said snake, and I just didn't realize what it was at first. So <laughs> just being a bit of a goof. Yeah. Krabby. Geodude. You're a bit of a Geodude. I look like Geodude? Yeah. Thank you. The Gambler. This is it. Is it? Oh. Nope. No. One more. This is it. Uno mas. Oh. One time. Ooh, oh, non-hollow Gengar. Huge hit. Non-hollow Gengar. It does look weird without the hollow. Mm -hmm. It looks like they fucked up. It also looks like 3D rendered art from like Super Mario 64. Uh, What's he standing on? The background's a little funky. Yeah, but back in the day, their backgrounds were just like explosion. They're like YouTube thumbnails from 2015. Mm. Uh, all right. Ben, this card, if you're wondering, is worth $300 at a PSA 10. Pretty good rare. One of the better ones for sure. And our first time getting it. You got her? I think Mount Fuji was hunting for Mew and Team Rocket used him to find it or something. Interesting. Next hall is Raichu, VIP if I'm correct, if not banned. Look, too many of you guys are asking now. I, I can't take care of you all. It was a one-time deal. Because one of you will be correct, but I'm not going to ban the other hundred. Golduck, the that's duck. a juicer. I do like the duck. 
Tentacruel. Once again. Sticking with the water. I do like the art in this one. I think Magmar? I like Jungle a little more. Magmar's art is insanely good. Because mm -hmm. they made him look like an idiot in Pokemon Snap. Did they? Yeah, he just kind of bumbles around. Gambler. Ammonite. Everyone's favorite. Grimer? Yeah, man. Just wait for him to evolve. It's going to be another muck here. I'm calling it. Hollow muck. Side duck. Damn. There it you is. Hit a 10 ducks. Yeah, we're at 10 ducks. That's lovely. That's like 2K PSA 10. I think we've got two more. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Another recycle. And here it is. Big juice, big juice. Oh, oh. Dragonite. Oh my oh. god, Ben. Oh. Hello. Damn, you pull like a machine. Are you oh, telling me I, <laughs> I should save up 30k and buy a box? I'm saying that if you don't, you're wasting your money. <laughs> Damn. So this Dragonite is non hollow, but PSA 10, it sells for $800. It's the most valuable non rare in this set. It's actually pretty cool because the rainbow effect in hollow doesn't look as good as it does uh, non hollow. The non-hollow rainbow just looks like a little tighter, a little better, I think, at least. Oh, I'm drifting. Hold up, let me get it as an example. <laughs> <laughs> My girlfriend's asking, uh, what is Pog? It's probably best to not know, to be honest. You know, you know what I mean? Like, oh shit. Oh, there. Oh, fuck. Bad, I dropped it. <laughs> it's alright. It's just 800. It's not our hollow. Couple of dragons. It's just like a little more saturated. You know what I mean? It looks different. It's just a bit dull with the hollow. Yeah, it's still cute though. Oh, they're both very cute, but I, I can see why this one like would also why, be wanted. Why did they make Dragonite's signature move slam? That's a good point. It is a pretty, I think that he, they use it in the anime a lot. Isn't it just hyper beam? Yeah, I guess Hyper Beam is right. Are they, I guess they, yeah, they wanted a normal move. And what's a good normal move? But I think Hyper Beam would have been a better choice. Yeah, I don't like Slam. Slam I got, is a bit of a funny one. I got one more. Yeah, you got another pack. You want to grab this one on the left? Yeah. I'm getting progressively better at opening the packs. Pog is a social problem. Yeah, that's right. It's a social illness. All right. Grimer. No, I gotta... Oh, yeah. We'll make this mistake again. All right. Play of the game. Who's that? That's Golem. Golem. He's a good one. Wheezing. Uh, actually, can you do me? A, can you grab me? You need pack? more? Yeah, I need a pack. Lovely. <laughs> Wheezing. I'm a star. How could it not shine? That's right. Grimer. I think we're. <laughs> <just pre> <laughs> Good one, Chet. Ooh, it's our favorite little duck. Damn, an eleventh duck. That's like eleven out of like what? Like twenty. Twenty packs. Yeah. That's good. Twenty-two, I think. That's really good. Just need a few more Mount Fujis and a few more Slow Bros. Mm-hmm. Shelder. What I could do is I could grade them and I could sell them as collections for a bit. You know, like I could just sell a collect the entire common collection. Yeah. Which I think would sell on eBay pretty easily. Zubat. Rather than having to individually sell. And then the more valuable ones I could do individual um, sales. Is this the one? I don't know. That is Kabuto. Oh, oh there it is. Is that's, that a hollow? That's a hollow oh. hit. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Is that, is that, yeah. Yeah. Is that's that a good? hollow Hitmonlee. I don't nah, know. Nah, it's not the best. 800? 787. 
800 still hype. Hitmonlee, it is hype. It is hype. We're just missing because we only have one hollow left now. Right? Only one hollow left? I think. Count your hollows. This is Hitmonlee PSA 10. Oh, not PSA 10, but Hitmonlee holographic. It's a little to the left like everything else has been. Uh, the hollow lines are what we care about. I don't know if Chad, you can see any. It looks pretty money. Bottom seems a little little whitening there. Corners seem good though. All in all, pretty good condition. Everything's in pretty good condition. Let's uh count how many hollows we got here. All right, so we got uh, we got uh all right we got Hitmon Lee for one of our hollows. This is not a hollow. We got oh that was just a film. A uh, hollow Dragonite two. No, no. Hollow Magneton three. Hollow Magneton four. Uh, hollow. Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl five, six, yeah, seven, uh huh, eight, nine, <laughs> ten, ten. So, so there's we twelve. We left. got two more. Yeah, two left. All right, not bad, not bad. I'm gonna do a little more tidying real quick. Yeah, sure. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven packs left. Which means somewhere along the way I fucked up. 11 packs left. 12 is a fixed amount of hollows. That's right. Thank you for the $30 donation. My bad, buddy. Thank you very much for that dono. Uh, let me check. What else you got? Nothing. Oh, it's because it pops up uh, on stream elements. I uh, wasn't logged in. What else I got for what? I was just uh, seeing if we needed garbage. a cleaner workspace, but I think we're okay. Oh, we're not doing too bad. Yeah, we're all right. Uh, thank you for the donation, Sally. CS2 boys. What is a what is it going to? I forget. It. Uh, what do you mean? L A C S two. Oh, the charity. Yeah. Uh, I, I, there's no charity picked at the moment, but we have eighty two thousand six hundred going towards it. Oh, does the winner pick the charity? That is that the how idea, that? Yeah? yeah. Okay. I might take a sponsor and then just pick the charity for it, but we'll see. Thank you for the thirty, Ari Pavic, who said wasn't a Raichu Sag. True, that is Sag. Thank you for the thousand bits, Frozen Gaijin. How many total values so far? All right, this is our last check until the end. If PSA 10, which obviously that's not going to be the case, but we'll find out. Uh, it would be $42,000. Almost double what we spent. Uh, PSA 9 would be 14000 So pretty good. The problem is there's only one hollow left. Two. Right? Two Didn't hollows you, you left. You counted to 10. Yeah, two hollows left, which is where the main chunk of value comes from. <laughs> How does this make sense? What? That's not updated. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's not updated. We're pulling at such a rate that... They just can't keep up with this yeah, speed. Yeah, yeah. Mount Fuji. Great start. Magmar. Oh. Ooh. Well, that was, was that the Magmar? For Amistar. No, the Magmar went down nice. Oh, uh, okay. But the Amistar got a bit of a tumble. It's all right. We'll sell it as a uh, dinged up player <laughs> card. Zubat. Energy Search. Ammonite. Psyduck. Great pack. Mount Fuji and a Psyduck. Imagine there's a Slowbro. I think Slowbro is almost only in the front. At least it's the only spot I've seen him in. Gambler. Geodude in a rare. I would love an Articuno. Oh, oh shit. shit! Call your shot. What is that? God dude. damn, it's beautiful. Yes. You need a heavy guy? Yes, I do. I got one. Oh hell yeah. That's it was, dude. It was your time, man. Oh, I love. It was that. your time. 
A holographic Articuno called it out. What a gorgeous card. This card is the uh, the 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 second or third most valuable in this set. PSA 10, the Articuno goes for 3,650. That's the last sale. It's the second most valuable card. So you got number one and two. Damn, that's hype. Give that guy a VIP who called it like six packs ago. <laughs> he called it every pack. In <laughs> <laughs> he eventually got there. Damn, that's hype. You were due, man. I was due. I was dumb and broke. <laughs> Aeropovic, thank you for the 20, buddy. Yeah. Is there any immediate... The centering is actually, I think, better. Because yeah. most of them have leaned left. This one leans actually right a bit, but barely. Uh, the back of it... Like maybe a little thing here you can see, but baby. How's the roundness of the corners? I don't know if that's a thing they... I guess cornering is what they'd look at. I, I, I don't know what looks good and what doesn't, though. All I can yeah. see is the whitening and the cornering, like, when there's marks on it. But the hollow is the most important part in it. I don't think we've had too many hollow lines in this. But chat will let me know if there is one. It seems pretty good, though. Yeah, it looks really money. Damn. All right, so the only other uh, card that's worth a good amount, uh, at least above 3,000, would be um, the Lapras. So if we get the Lapras, we're... As our last hollow? Yeah, we're great, because that's like the top three hollows. What about the other legendary birds? We got Zapdos. As a hollow? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah we did. Remember, uh, yeah. The... the Moltres would be cool to get because I would like to finish the set, but that's 1,500. Is the Articuno missing uh, that top left hollow part again? No, no. They only no? did that with Zapdos, apparently. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, I don't know how they fucked that. This is like a bit of an oversight. <clears throat> All right. Let's get into them. We got ourselves a sand slash, a Golbat. The art is fire for that. Oh, I oh, quickly wait, ooh, snuck out a, a uh, wheezing. <laughs> uh, wheezing as well. Mysterious Fossil. Grimer. There's no Snorlax in this one. Kabuto. That's the jungle set, the previous one. Ammonite. Tentacle. Energy Search. Psyduck. I would like to pull the Articuno non-hollow. Hitmonlee non-hollow. Did we get this one already? I think we yeah, did. Yeah, right? we did. She's a repeat. I'll just put this in the repeat section. All right, my last pack. We have a hollow and a non-hollow Hitmonlee. Dragonite last. We already got a Dragonite, but I wouldn't mind a second. I guess there's no reason you can't get one. We got two uh, Magnetons. And quite a few Mucks. Golduck. Lovely. Arbok. Slowbro. Juicy. Kabuto. Tentacool. Horsey. Mysterious Fossil, Ekans, Grimer, aka Precum, Shelder, and our rare is up. Uh, boys, checking to see if you have a Twitch Prime available. That that's that's our rare today. Do me a quick favor and double check to see if you have a, a Prime chat, because that's the real value. Forget about the cards. Let's worry about the primes. Because every day, chat, a Prime renews. And it could be yours. So if you're tabbed out, tab in for a moment and check to see by clicking the subscribe button and seeing if it says subscribe free in purple. If it does, that means you got one and you got to use it. You don't have to use it on me. I am unoffended. Un unmoved. I think that's the right phrasing. Use it on Mango. Use it on Cutie. Use it on Small Ant. Mango looking good. It's the first time I've not seen him wear a tank top in years. Uh, Toph. 
Otto is doing a Raid Shadow Legends sponsorship, I guess. Jack the Alien, whoever, boys, just make sure to use them. Uh, the only reason I shout it out is because every time I do, I get 100 primes. Because you guys just don't do that. Thank you, Kara, Replina, Kyota, uh, Kyota. Hold up. I'll thank you more after this card. Let it focus in. 10 primes to focus. What's going on? There it is. Here it is. Articuno, non hollow. Oh. oh. That's not bad. It's, we haven't gotten it. Hypno, non hollow. Oh, yeah, we haven't. We're filling up the uh, the list. I would like to get all the non hollows if I can. Yeah, it's fulfilling. It immediately starts with a hype train. That's because it takes 25 to start a hype train, and the 25 people just check, and they're like, oh, damn, he's right. If I said it and no one had any primes, I would never say it again because it would just be kind of embarrassing. All right. We got four stacks for each of us left. Which stack do you want, left or right? I'll take your right hand. All right. These are yours. Oh, you know, but should I bink four in a row and then you, yeah, you close yeah. it out? Yeah. All right. Thank you, setting Nate Bay. Same thoughts. Appreciate that. Thank you very much, Griffin Dragon Fotis. Uh, Nuke432, Matthew0004, Gonals. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. Appreciate that. Tyrant Shadow, Board Braint, Parts15 Months, Killu, uh, Gifted Community Sub, Gonals. Thank you again. Megan, uh, Terry Andrews, Abby Marcotti. Thank you, the subs, boys. This is not nice beard Ludwig <laughs> or big Ludwig. I weigh more than Ben does, and I'm taller than him. Yeah, he's got about an inch on me. I got an inch, and I got a good 10 pounds. But I got about two inches on him. Okay, don't. My guy. It's not. Don't have to bring up mice. Tilted Tide, the thousand bits. Wow. Iguana Milk. Thank you for the prime, buddy. Slow, bro. Juicy start. Magmar. Magmus. Give me another duck. Oh, <laughs> and there she is. Two ducks. A side duck as well. It's coming. Zizzle. Thank you for the prime. Late night yeats. Thank you for the three months. What the fuck? Cows are black. Thank you for the prime. Silent. 96. Thank you for the prime. Mysterious fossil. So mysterious. Ammonite. Grimer. Horse of the sea. Mm. Mm. Aren't horses real? I don't know. What do they call them? Uh, are you talking about seahorses? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. <laughs> but they're kind of real. It's like the same thing. Look, man, this is it. Oh, is it? Yep. Oh my Dude, god. How many magnetons? We already got that one too, right? Yeah, we've had a non hollow mag. Four magnetons and four comes. This goes straight to the duplicate pile. Yeah, don't even top load it. Thank you, Chiz in the Box, the Dildong, Snyder, uh, Trillin for the 500 bits, e Efernal, e or Ephemeral, the Gifted Core JDD. Ephemeral. Thank you, the seven months. What does, does that mean something? Ephemeral, it's, uh, I think it's an artery. Oh, like the ephemeral artery? Yeah. Oh. I think. I should know this. Some medicine thing, though? Yeah. Sorry, guys. Oh, I'm pulling. Okay. That makes sense why that Ferg, wasn't happening. Kingslayer, thank you, the, the prime. Uh, your boy, Brian, thank you, buddy. We got about six more or seven more, something something like that. This thing means ghost. You're thinking of femoral is what they're saying. Hmm? They oh. say you're thinking of femoral. Oh. I don't know. I stream for a living. I, I this science shit doesn't. I'm thinking of here. femoral artery. Oh, the femoral. Yeah. It's not femoral. It's not whatever that guy's name was. Whatever, guys. English majors don't do science words. It's different. I have Melvin. Not... Think of the seven. All right, what you got for us, slow bro? Sand That's slash? a sand slasher. Hey, hold on. Uh, we need another pack. You do. We, we're really going through a lot of these. Yeah, we need 300. All right. 
Excuse me. Run it. Sand slash. I'm a star. Mm -hmm. That's ghastly. Kind of like the ghastly art. I do too a little bit. Another snake. And followed by a bat. The Atkins kind of just looks like the Aerodactyl. Yeah, it's like Same zoomed face. in on its open face. This Animal Slow Crossing poke. New Horizons music. It's New Leaf, you zoomer. Shelder. Wait, is it? <laughs> yeah, it is. Cool. You had to be right. Shelder. The Gambler. Mm-hmm. Krabby. I want to say... Okay. Two more? Yeah. Krabby. Kabuto. We have an army of those. And then... Uh, 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 Kabutops. That's pretty good. Oh, not yeah. We, 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 haven't haven't not, we haven't not had that one, so we'll I take it. I think that closes out our all, collection. All the, all the uh, non-hollows, you mean? I think we have one of every non-hollow now. Yeah. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Dope. So we, we finished the collection. So I can sell at least one entire collection of fossil commons. Oh wait, we don't have the Articuno. Yeah, that is true. Oh wait, no, I already grabbed another one. You have more, right? Yeah, yeah, I got a pack. I'm just checking the uh, score because it's oh, at, yeah. at about half time. Oh, it's about half time ready? Yeah. This is our fantasy football game. What time is it? It's been an hour. He has not caught the ball. Wow. It's canticles at halftime. It's like so. Oh, it's second oh, yeah, quarter. It's just the second quarter. Oh, why is uh? He's looking for Mark Andrews. Why is Mark Andrews not caught the ball? Points. I guess it hasn't been thrown his way. I'm assuming if it threw his way, he'd get it. Lamar Jackson's uh, he's solved. We didn't get the uh, Articuno, so I don't know why it's not on here. Oh, yeah, no, it's just on the right. It, it's a different order, I think. Uh, all right, what you got for us? Okay, three on the bottom. We're starting off with... A Tentacruel. Lovely. Tentacruel. Weezing. Golbat. Snake. Duck. We love a duck. Hollow Lapras. I would love that. So mysterious. Man, how many ducks is it? Geodude. Ludwig said I look like Geodude. Yeah. A hot Geodude. Slowpoke. A beard. Imagine Geodude with a beard. Probably waves. would be weird. Shelder. Wave is this it? Geodude. I always... No? No, you got a couple more. Okay. Zubat, this is it. This is the one. What's the call? Lapras! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, they love me. I hate them, though. You gotta hate a fifth Magneton. God. We're looking at almost 20% now. 15% of this entire box. That is a pretty cringe card to pull. I like the word you're using. I don't know why I'm saying it. Because it's accurate? It's just because you were saying it, so now I don't have a choice. It has entered the vocab. Yeah. Much like your use of electric. Yeah. Filters into others. Well, I think it's only fair that you pull the final hollow, probably, so... This is about what should be expected. Sorry, I forgot to open it on stream. You're fine. It'll be fine. That's fine. Oh, it's right here. Oh, different. Yes. My friend Ben. Hey, it's not me, guys. All right. All right. In Psyduck Watch, by the way, we are sitting at a juicy 14 Psyducks. Cloister? 18 would be a perfect half of the uh, packs. Sand Slash. 
Oh, good. Fuge. Balls. I do love Fuge. You called it Mount Fuji earlier, and it threw me off. It made me second guess if it was a oh, mountain yeah. or a man. It is definitely Mr. Fuji. Yeah. Wait, Mount Fuji's the real thing, not the Pokemon thing. I'm just Mount realizing. Fuji's, yeah. It's an actual mountain. Right, 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 yeah. right. Energy Search. Best card followed by the worst card. Love that. Our most popular card. Kabuto. Kabuto Watch. This is our... Uh... Krabby. No, actually, we have more slow pokes. I do play melee. Ben kind Tentacool. of crushes. I used to. He is a fearsome fox in a washed up Jigglypuff. <laughs> Recycle. The Gambler. He beat Taj. Yeah. The man who got second at Genesis 2. Or third? Horsey. Uh, he got third. Full high. There you go. Alright. I am the You're My Man's guy. All right, horsey, and this is it? This is uh, this is it for me. Is it a mag? Oh, oh, oh the non-hollow heart. Yeah, that's a good pull. My guy. First one, completing the collection. Non-hollow Aerodactyl. Yeah, that's a juicy one. We we uh we hard that one. You got a hard sleeve somewhere? Yeah. There you go. Thanks, guys. Four packs left. Finish strong, Lud. Let's make some magic happen. I got one hollow in these four. Look, I'm not going to dance monkey dance for you guys. I'm sorry. Want you to say you're my man's? They do. Yeah, he's an adult, guys. He lives his life. He doesn't get paid to entertain you fucks like I do. Yep. I'll do it though. I'm a chill. <laughs> you primes come my way. All right, last four packs, chat. What are we feeling? What do you got? Do you want to start start worse or start best? I want to start Lapras because we got two of them. Okay. And I'll keep the last Lapras for last because I think that Lapras will have the Lapras in it. Okay. Orion, think of the seven months, buddy. So after this, we'll check the, uh, the, the potential value based off current sales of all the cards. All right, we got Golem. Graveler. I'm assuming a Geodude's hidden in here too. Kingler. Gambler, Recycle, Krabby, Shelder, Ekans. I think I've called all the hollows so far. The the two juicers, I mean. Mysterious Fossil. I called your Dragonite in my uh, my Articuno. Yeah, you really did Babe Ruth it. Grimer. <laughs> At this point, would you rather see a Muck or a Magneton? Uh, I think I'd rather see a Magneton still than <laughs> Mr. Cum. Mr. Cum. But that is six Magnetons, which is crazy because uh, <laughs> they're not worth a lot. We still did pull a hollow drag. True. But. Well, I guess I did. 20% of this is Magnetons. They're about. All right. Three more. Looking for a nice slow bro? Nope. Graveler. The gold bat art's great. Mr. Fuji. Lovely. Actually, very cute card. Sucks that he got a Weedle, though. Ammonite. Psyduck. Horsey. Gambler. Geodude. Ekans. Tentacool. Oh, oh holographic oh, haunter. Fuck. Our 
Our final holographic card is the Haunter, a $710 card. That we already have, PSA right? 10. We do not have it in hollow. Oh, no? We have okay. the Gengar. Okay. So it is a new hollow, but it is not the best hollow um, that we didn't get, at least. Lapras would have been a little better, but still pretty good. Better than Muck or Magneton. Uh, we can still strike pretty well in these last two if it's another Dragonite or a non-hollow Lapras. So let's see what we got. Still, two more packs. Kingler. Golem. Weezing. Ekans. Zubat. Yeah, I'm not too mad because we got the first and second most valuable cards. And the most valuable uh, non-hollow. Uh, so it's still a pretty good pack. And we also hit a lot of Psyducks. Which uh, are quite valuable. Oh, shit. I didn't even realize it was the rare. All right. <laughs> uh, our rare is a non hollow first edition Gengar, $300 PSA 10. Another good one. We love that. Worth about as much as a holographic muck. And that means we have one pack left. This is everything, boys. Last one's a Magneton. If this is a Magneton, I ban Hunt Boom. I'll remember his name. Golbat, not in focus. There it is. Another Mr. Fuji. We love that. Give me one Psyduck for the road. A road duck. Graveler Geo, dude. Pre cum. Energy search. Horsey. Almanite. Ekans, Psyduck, there's the Road Duck, and this is going to be it. Our final card of the night. Not going to be a Magneton. <laughs> Another um... Haunter. Not a bad card. Uh, the Haunter is 313, actually. Uh, it's worth more than the Gengar in non hollow You going to ban Hunt Boss anyway? Nah. No? He asks for it every time. Oh, okay. Can't give them what they want. Yeah, that's, the, that's, the, that's, what, that's what I've been saying. All right, pretty good. So let's take a look at all of our rares and our hollows and see what we ended up with. Then we'll take a look at the chart to see how much it's all worth, hypothetically. Uh, and we'll see if we can get that value. Look at this one. Look at that. Energy search? Yeah, she's a bit warped. It's warped as fuck. It's a hollow. Uh, do you want me to shine a light on it? I can't tell. I can't tell. Is this hollow chat? It is, right? Here. It's such a weak hollow. Yeah, yeah it's it hollow. Is. I just can't tell with some. All right, so these are our final polls. These are our rares. We got all the commons, but our rares were pretty good. We got a hollow, uh, no, sorry, excuse me. Non hollow Dragonite, Gengar, Zapdos, Raichu, Moltres, Articuno, or excuse me, Gengar, or Haunter, Moltres again, Aerodactyl, Magneton, Articuno, Hypno, Gengar, and another Haunter. So we got all the legendary birds in our hollows. Uh, also pretty good. We got Hitmon Lee, the Dragonite, best card in this, Magneton, Magneton, Aerodactyl, Zapdos, Hypno, Gengar, Kabutops, Muck, Articuno, and Haunter. So we're just missing the, uh, Flareon for the set, but... Flareon? Uh, for all three. Overall, I feel, uh, pretty fulfilled. So this is our final numbers. Uh, adding everything up, our final number, assuming everything's PSA 10, which again, the whole point of this exercise is to get everything graded at the end, so we'll see, but, uh, this is phase one. Phase one is finding the value of them, uh, or just pulling them, I should say, and then phase two will be finding the value, but if they were all PSA 10, pause champ, if every single card was PSA 10 in this set, it would be a total value of
$55,409. Now, it won't all be PSA 10, which is why the PSA 9 value would be... $20,249.89. AKA, breaking even. So if it was 20240 I think I'd about break even. I It's, it's about over 1000 than what I spent, but I'd have to get everything graded and shipped, so I'd lose money there. Mm -hmm. um, and then the final number that I wanted to find was if everything was PSA 10 except for the hollows, and those were PSA 9. Because if you guys don't know, hollows are the hardest thing to get PSA 10 because of the uh, the, the holographic, the surfacing of, of it. Oftentimes just has uh, like lines or whatever. It ruins it. So... If you added up all of the PSA 10 commons, plus the hollows as PSA 9, the final value would be... Final drum roll. $25,000 at 62 and 18 cents. So 25k. So not bad. Uh, we're going to find out after I get everything graded where it actually lies. We'll do a second stream then. After I get all the cards back, it might not be for a while, to be completely honest with you, because I know they're slammed at PSA. But that's uh, that's the plan, to get them all graded and uh, and find out where we lie at the end of that. Uh, and then we'll, we'll sell them all after we find the grading of them, and then we'll see how much money we make or lose. Uh, it wasn't too bad, though. We had pretty good pulls. We came out better than Mr. Beast. Yeah, we're definitely, like, even if it's all PSA 9... Probably going to make most of our money back. Yeah. Uh, well, it depends. Because we'll lose a lot of money getting them graded. That's where I'm nervous. All right. I got to piss real quick. We're going to run one final ads. And then uh, and then, and then, then we're out. That's the show. All right. I'll let them hang with Papa Ben for a bit. Papa Ben. Overall... I'm pretty impressed. What's up, guys? Oh, you want me to become Ludwig? Here it is. Boys! You said that doesn't sound like you? Better Ludwig. That's a true. Best pull of the day was, uh, that'd be me pulling a hollow Dragonite. <laughs> Is that a good slash? That was a nice one. Hey, let me get the back. You took over the chair. Uh, all right, boys, 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 boys. Uh, tomorrow, tomorrow at 3 p.m., we're going to be doing the uh, chat versus me in Pokemon. You can use your channel points to affect which Pokemon I run into in the wild. You can also use uh, your dollars that'll go to charity to affect me negatively in game or positively, but I assume you won't do that. Uh, and at noon, I think we're playing some games with some other people as well. Uh, that's all tomorrow, but today it is the end of stream. We're going to hang out with Ben. We're going to watch the rest of the football game. I know short stream, but I just wanted to open that box uh, so we can go on with this idea I've had for a while. So I'm going to get these all graded. We'll do a follow-up in the future. Oh, you know when. Uh, but that's it for me. That's it for me, boys. By the way, uh, exclamation point Audible in chat. Check out Audible, please, for the love of God. Check them out. Uh, a lot of you guys haven't been, but I think they're one of the cooler sponsors we've had, and the deal's pretty good for Audible. Because when I first joined, I think it was 15 a month, and I think now it's 7.99. After six months, the first six months are 5.99 or something. Unlimited audiobooks, podcasts, all that. If that's a thing you want to do. Alex19 messaged me about my Audible code. Thanks, Alex. And you guys can too. Use code Ludwig. But that's it. That's it. I'm done. I'm gonna wrap up and go eat food. Uh, Ben's stream is just living his life. <laughs> yeah, I don't stream, guys. Uh, I'm going to, uh, end though. I think Cutie's not streaming for much longer. Uh, just, oh, just kidding. <laughs> uh, I'm going to raid Connor 
Because I've not raided him in a while. But Cutie's also alive. You guys want to give Cutie some love. Cutie Cinderella. But uh, I'll raid Connor for now. I haven't raided Connor in a minute. Uh, a lot of good Smash stuff happening today as well. True. Uh, but you guys know where that is. Uh, uh, anyway, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Thank you for watching. I'll see you all tomorrow. Peace. Bye. Later, Later guys. Goodbye, guys. Goodbye. Have a good day. Goodbye. We're going to get his glasses. The glasses storage.